I mean, fuck it. Free advertisement. So. Who the fuck am I? I'm the guy trying to fly by most. I gotta drive my ride, I boast. You ever eye my side piece, don't. Cause I got a piece on my side, no, I don't. I got my CD on repeat, cause the beast beat that sub. Power up like DBZ, no GT, that sucked. Except for Super Saiyan 4, that shit was fire. Fire as fuck, so when I release an MP3, better retweet and love. I'm officially meta, better get the four walls. War calls, more fall. Corny rappers like Gorval, red and baka hotter than the core, y'all. I can switch a style up, spit it slow as dial up. Why'd you fidget getting riled up? It'll take a while, but I'm spitting vile, bruh. You would never believe that I sucked when I first rap. Now all I ever get is love, and I earned that. All this sweat, tears, and blood, fans return that. Look at all this shit I've done, I can't turn I'm back. Fun you know, this in hip hop, I think, uh, I think we don't take enough time to just enjoy what we're doing. I think we focus so much on being serious, you know, being lyrical and being talented that we, we don't even stop to just think about how great the shit we do is. And I'm gonna try to change that perspective. So let's do this. Yeah. I've been giving everything inside my heart and all my music can be solo Master of the art, with the light of dark, day and night inside my dojo Can I pull some bitches with the witness like a boat, homie, that's a row row All my fans be watching me like a body cam or a GoPro They go. Doesn't really matter what beat I beat up Cause the industry shows me no love, just like Vegeta Except for Dragon Ball Super, they kinda been, uh Really be giving my boy love, so you rappers better play dead like a zombie with a toy gun. Man, I live with my music, so live it to do with the gift. Terrific, terrific, it's a give it to you. Gotta work the pen until your hand is falling off, and then you feel the genius spitting through you. Nobody told me like ever that I would be killing it. I'm living my life for the minute I'm giving it relevant. Damn it, I'm murdering beats, you can hear them in the streets like a megaphone on an elephant. Man, I'm just so real, catch me in the back, chilling with your mom, drinking dick of bombs with the baker on. Talk about a song, shitty rapper songs, yep, shitty rapper songs, dude. I really didn't want to Had to put you on blast But if I get basic It's back upon you And I think It's really important that You know, we get these opportunities uh, to, to still be topical And still be able to, to flex your abilities musically But I think it's so important To, to also be able to just Say what you want to Even if it, even if it isn't you know, super crazy topical or anything like fuck Dragon Ball, you know? <laughs> Gotta get another try while I'm popping off. Blasting off on a rap song like Team Rocket Jaw. Scatter your ashes to the mist like I got Brock involved. I'm like a midget playing T ball, I can't knock it off. <laughs> Me and my team, we see past a lot. Energy seething, we had to stop. All I'm trying to say is it's fucking bullshit that the legendary Super Saiyan Brawly's trigger word was Kakarot! I'm about to beat the brakes off of your bitch ass You got no class and your girl when she gets so passed All around the room like an old flask I could even do better with no raps on an old Mac as an old man Every time I spit a verse that's so potential You was thinking I was Gohan Ready for Rohan, ready for war plans Ready for anyone thinking they got dope man Consider this you find a warning You should take a chips and get up at the dope man Grab your coat man, we give no hand Anybody who be rapping so bland I don't give a fuck, I'm having fun And I am free, you wait and then you was no fan Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another Sunday Sunday. What's go? Jesus Christ, are you joking? What? Work. At 7.30 at night on a Sunday. I'm not answering. My uh, business is not open right now. I she would, can send a text message. Yeah. No. I thought it was the kid. No, it's not the kids. <laughs> I was about to say. <laughs> no, it's a work customer. Ah, hello, everyone. Welcome back to another Sunday Sunday. What's going on out there, chat? Happy Sunday. I see a call for hearts in the chat already from Axel Fire Fury. Let's see it, man. Sorry, shit's got you down, buddy. I hope everything works out well. What's going on, everybody? Happy Sunday. Hope everyone's having a lovely, lovely day out there today. Let's see who we got hanging out in the chat. Wild Spirit, what up? Alec, Elena, Murbear, Joanna, uh, Mad Yikes on Bikes, Fear the T-Rex, 
Joe, uh, Despresso, Espresso, Halloweeny, Jalapanusi, Badusi, Shakusi, mm -hmm. uh, completely and utterly unrelated to anything Shrek. There is a new. It better not be a Shrek. Limited time. Oh, We're looking God. at sea otters. Six of them here. That's fucking Obi Wan Kenobi. <laughs> We're looking at sea otters. A very limited time twenty-five dollar donation. Is it Shrek? Uh Sticky Booger, hello. Mama Kimmins, Galaxy Shine. <laughs> History, so much trouble. History buff, a tiller. Hello, hello. Let the pee pee hit the poo. Let the pee pee hit the poo. Let the I pee hate pee this. Hit the poo. Let the pee pee hit the <laughs> This is awful. Why is this even in here? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I forgot I had that one. I'm married to a 12 year old. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, what is wrong with you? Jesus. Nothing, what's up with you? <laughs> Pissing off Shelly within five minutes. You should see what that $25 one is. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, yes, yes, oh, yes. No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, boy, howdy. What the LMFAO people like that one? Good. Good. That's you a people good. are, you have issues. All of you have issues. Call to Curl said, what dis? I know what you were expecting, but that wasn't it. Oh, and Cult subscribe with Prime. Or, no, it was G, my bad. Uh, are we going to have, how much fun are we going to have tonight? So much. So, so much. much fun. But we have to be very careful. Very careful about what we say. Because I don't want anyone going, I'm making fun of someone for having diabetes. No. We would never do that. Why would we ever do that? At least he's not burping in our ear. He's been burping all day, so I think we're in for it, John. Yeah, that's true. Did Livy find the donut? No. No. Uh, we watch Lol Cows, of course we have issues. I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. In love with Shelly, good. Aww. Spy it, Pondu. Spy it, Pondu, I love you too. It's a solid, solid, uh, everyone get out your blood sugar testing kits. <laughs> you know those things you just have laying around the house? Uh, shall I don't know to piss Shelly off? It's 25 flat is for the new one. It's, it can't be that bad, is it? No. If it's Shrek, you're going to be... Chantel's Raw Dogging Life. I, Karina, your names are amazing. Uh-oh. Everything okay? Um... Yeah, I got it. Uh, I'm on my last hate speech strike. Let's get nuts. No, you get nuts over there. We're not getting nuts over here. Ay, ay, ay. Uh... Here it comes. What? No. Oh my god. Why? What the? F oh, gross. Why? Why would why would you even make that? Why would anybody even make that? Oh my god. <sighs> if I had a fucking dollar from Friday night till Sunday morning, the amount of time somebody sent me that shit, Twitter writ large would be the new stacker member. <laughs> <laughs> People were just quote tweeting, saying, hey, at Sinatra says, just writing it in the comments, at Sinatra, at Sinatra. And I'm like, someone's going to see this and go, this dude must really love Ricky or Shrek. Ricky's okay. He kind of creeps me out sometimes. But him with the Shrek, it's just, it's, this is very disturbing. I am disturbed. Oh, my God. It's the noises. Oh, God. No, uh, no, 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 going to hell for this. Uh, 
I can't do a heart. I have to do a heart. Okay. Uh, Cult of Curl. I love this so much. <laughs> Thank you, Cult. Uh, Natal. Thank you for the 25, and thank you for the very nice card again, Nadles. Uh, Magnus Borson, how many on the train is this? Well, it got derailed immediately, but, you know, in the spirit of love and whatnot, we'll, we'll say that. We'll say that's riding. We'll say that one's just riding out. That's fine with me. Uh, thank you so much, Magnus. Ten, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, on the Awu train. Oh, man, I'm, I'm having a hard time here, Miss Sins. <laughs> Doing something, and I gotta try to do it all on my own. I'll just do it. I gotta just send a work message. Okay. Um, is Livy missing Shelly's reaction to the dono? I don't know where Livy is. She's but probably drunk somewhere. It's true. That's true. Guys, we're gonna get right into this. We don't have a lot of time to dilly and or dally, and we have a lot to go over. We are 10 on the Awu train getting into this guy. Smash the like button, share it out on your social medias should you feel so inclined please consider hitting up that streamlabs we have tons of new donos a great temporary shrek dono <laughs> and a thruple with ricky shrek eiffel tower yeah sure let's go um uh the the, the new donos and the things with the liking and the sharing and the who not and the whatnot we're gonna get right into the first video because we got a lot lot to go over we're doing this in chronological order from three days ago. Now, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight videos from her in three days. That's a lot. About three a day. Wow. I have eight videos from her in three days that we're going to go over. The first one is called Grocery Haul for Family of Two in Kuwait. How much did it cost? Uh, Blue-Eyed Panther, welcome to the middle class. Thank you so much for joining. Appreciate the support. Let's get into this. God bless it. Oh, and we have an updated bingo card. I had an engagement farming. Uh, stops talking to eat. Gaslighting or bringing up kids. I couldn't think of another thing to put them on two separate ones, so it's fine. So we got some new bingos to look out for, too. Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> hey there, beezers. Want a personalized video from me to you that you can no. keep answered? Cameos. That's a log on me, but it's a bit noisy for the video, but it works. Oh, jeez. <coughs> okay, hold on. <clears throat> Those I things gotta, don't work at all. I gotta move this real quick. Right, I need a. I need to change something else. I need. I need something else changed. Why? Because I got it. Something has to be fat activities. Funko activities. No fat activities. Okay, the gaslighting brings up kids doesn't happen often enough. Or the stops talking to eating is basically a free space that should not be there. No. I need, I need a different one. Makes up lover? Mm, okay, no. fine. Yeah, because I mean, we know salad's made up. That's also a free space. She doesn't make up fake men anymore that she's talking to. On Stares a chat with Ratface? No, take off makes up lover. She, she never streams anymore. No, take, she does sometimes. Take off makes up lover. Mm-hmm. Because that was when she used to, like, pretend she was talking to some new guy and they never existed. Yeah, that's true. Talk to the chat for a second. Hi, chat. Fat Funkle activity. I would think Funkle activities counts as fat activities, but I, mean, I guess there's a difference of being Funkle-like and just being fat. Yeah. Chantel is getting raw dog by life. She kind of is, yeah. I mean, it's, it's based on her own choices, though. Yeah. She, she kind of did to herself. It 100% did it to herself. No sympathy and fat activities putting the fan on. Or first meal activities. That's a <coughs> good one. But yeah, that would count as fat activities. Yes. I lost my father this morning at the young age of 82. Uh -huh. uh, my mom died earlier this year. She was 82. Two. A drink and a whiskey in his memory to watch the sins to make me laugh. Also, fuck dementia. Bleed purple. Oh, man, I'm... So sorry to hear it, Raven. Guys, let's get big hearts in the, in the chat, chat for Raven. Raven. I know exactly what you're going through, my friend. It's it's going to get a lot worse soon. <laughs> Works very well. So I just wanted to show you that I have a neck fan now, and I use it when I'm doing dishes or things in the kitchen, stuff like that, and it adjusts very well. So yeah, here's the fan. Um, it's a bit noisy for the video, though, but... <laughs> okay, so um, I'm going to get right into the grocery to get sucked into that fan, because that's the worst thing about those. No shit. Um, I'm gonna show you guys the total at the end. I'm not gonna like 
convert every item that would take me forever. So I'm gonna show you what I got. I'm gonna start with the things that need to go in the fridge ASAP. So we were out for quite a while. Um, all right, so here we go. Um, so for um, some meat here. We are on the couch with meat. Yes. We can't even stand in the kitchen to put the groceries away while we show them. I, and she's not doing cooking videos anymore. I think she has a new apartment, so she'll have a new kitchen. Maybe. No, she's cooked since she's been back from... I don't think she's cooked in the past, like, three weeks. Right, but when they got the new apartment, it was when they got back from Thailand. I don't know. Maybe. I think they moved directly into a new apartment. Have some beef cubes and some minced lamb. I thought Brown it was beef, meat. but... Beef cubes. Okay. Just out on the couch. Is it... Out on the couch. Laying out. On the couch. Beef cubes, low fat. Let's just take all and our groceries and dump them on the couch. This is a great plan. That is. It says a lamb right there. Why did you think it was beef? It says lamb. New Zealand lamb carcass. Yum. And it's fucking brown. Lamb carcass. That would be just right in the trash. If I got that from the grocery store, that's going right in the garbage. Wouldn't carcass imply like dead animal on side of the road, not meat that was butchered? Yeah. I don't, I don't, I think of carcass as like rotting carcass. That's going right in the garbage. <laughs> That's going right in the garbage. The um, minced lamb, I thought it was beef, but That's, no. I, mean, I know you're they, thinking, oh, well, it's like a weird color. I don't know why, but. Maybe okay, lamb we have is a weird some butter. Three, you get one free. Or maybe that's what you got from the food pick. Oh. And we have, oh, six yogurts. Six. She doesn't even know what they are. Yeah, I've. I, th I don't feel like she's buying her own groceries. I mean, no, she's definitely not buying. Unless just picking stuff up and then she's guessing what it is when she looks at it. Yeah, she's not buying them. Plain yogurts. Yes. I don't think this is... Uh, Elmerai is a popular food, dairy brand here. All right, now Carcass we have this band frozen yes. stuff. So, we have two packages of chicken strips. These are the... Okay, no, this is not food bank food. The ones I no, use for McDonald's wraps. Strips. They're super crispy and just really good. I have some frozen corn, frozen spinach. We have some 1 kg of black. This is another $200 food haul. This is like 700 bucks in 10 days that mm -hmm. they spent on food, supposedly spent. But she never cooks any of it, so where does it go? Fucking trash. Oh, it's, I, we love these, you can tell, right? Another thing of chopped spinach. Some mixed berries to go in the yogurt. And another thing of frozen corn. We have some Romy cheese. It's a cheese that I've, I've described it before. It's like a, a mix between a Parmesan, like a fresh Parmesan and a- This is what she was binging on in the stream, I think. A aged cheddar. It's very sharp and really delicious to go on some burgers or something like that, just for a snack. We also have a half kg of pickles. So you got a pound of pickles? Is calf kg a pound? Mm -hmm. Is a pound two kgs? Mm -mm. Kilogram is 2.2 .2 pounds. Oh, okay. We have also some one kg of frozen chicken breast More fillets. Frozen chicken. These are nice when they're thawed out and cooked. Did I miss something? These Burgers are nice when snack? thawed out and cooked. I mean, would they be better frozen? Well, we have finish. some frozen chicken. It's we nice to thaw and cook. We have some 1 kg of black olives. <laughs> we love these, you can tell, right? Another thing of chopped spinach. Some mixed berries to go in the yogurt. And another thing of frozen corn. We have some roe cheese. We need a lot of corn, apparently. It's a cheese that I've, I've described it before. It's like a, a mix between a Parmesan, like a fresh Parmesan, and a aged cheddar. It's very sharp and really delicious. To go on some burgers or something like that, just for a snack. <laughs> just for a snack. Some burgers for a snack. Not burgers for dinner. Snack burgers. Funkle activities. I her telling us that the chicken is better fat activities thawed and cooked than frozen is also funkle activity. That's true. <laughs> we also have a half kg of pickles. We have also some one kg of frozen chicken breast fillets. These are nice when they're thawed out and cooked. As opposed to. It's, it's, Frozen and cooked. As opposed to gnawing on them <laughs> as a chicken. A snack. It's a, a snack. A chicken sickle. <laughs> nice cold snack. <laughs> we have a bag of frozen broccoli. Oh, yay. 
We have a double pack of halloum cheese. She's probably upset. This is double not a lot of junk food. Tomato paste? What the fuck? Give tomato paste? What do you need eight cans of tomato paste for? They're little juice boxes. Okay, so it's probably more than a tomato paste. What do you need eight fucking cans of tomato paste for? She's going to make a uh, skeddy. You don't use tomato paste. What do you use? Tomato, crushed tomatoes. You don't put tomato paste in your skeddy? So the way I do it. And are you, you going to give away the secret recipe? The, no, this is what I, how I do it. You get the big cans of the crushed tomatoes. You always get Cento. You get the big cans of the crushed tomatoes. For every three cans of those, you do one can of tomato paste. Okay, so you do use tomato paste. Yeah, but she would have to make three, six, nine, Maybe twelve, twenty-four, twenty-four things. Paste. Maybe she'll just use all tomato paste. Okay, we have double package of tortilla chips, tortilla, I mean, tortilla wraps, and we have six packs of tuna. She doesn't look happy about these groceries. She's not. Because She's like, it's where's not... the chips? Where's the junk food? Where's the... Pickles. Where's the snacks? Where's the chocolate? Right. Yeah. All right. These are cool. We have two different sizes of chips. Oh, the, what, those, what, those are both a, a snack for Chantel. Not Chickens. dinner we for have... her family. Just uh, she's going to cook herself a whole chicken oh, and yeah. mangle it up again. Um, Frozen roller chickens, they call them. Make roasted chicken. We have just a huge Can bag cook of Cook it for six bread. hours again. <laughs> okay, we have ready. some. Oh, we have some strawberry and we have some chocolate croissant. 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 My little croissant. Well, there, that she got some snacky snacks there. Another case of those. Pop, pop. Okay, so yeah, this definitely yeah. is not food bank. Food. No, this is. Yeah, this is celebrant shopping. Yeah, it, this is a great pause, by the way. Her pop, favorite pop popcorn sticks. Mr. Potato. Makes me laugh. Look at this. This is fucking. This is whatever their version of BJ's is food. Mm -hmm. Bottom teeth, they look like howies. I, That's it's his not tongue, stupid. Teeth, you dipshit. I'll bet you money that his family took him shopping for this stuff. Probably. <laughs> or is that his tongue? I don't know. This is for Salah. He loves this. Um, mortadella. Three cans. See how, look how annoyed. Why is she so f upset about groceries right now? Look how mad she We're is. We're rolling our eyes at Salad picking something he wanted for groceries. Is that what that was? These are for Salad. Look how... And a big eye roll. Look how <laughs> fucking mad she is. Holy <laughs> shit. Foodie, why are you so angry? You got your 70 packs of Pop Pops. Calm down. Grocery shopping is exhausting. You didn't go. You're taking stuff out of the bag and sitting on the couch that you sat on the whole time while the grocery shopping was happening. And then Sally came and put all the bags in front of you and you're huffing about having to look in the bag. You're not even going to move them to the kitchen. Sally's going to have to go rebag up all this stuff that you just piled over there and go put it away. Jesus. Got some mixed berry juice. But two of those. How mad she is. Yeah, she doesn't know what's in here. Mm -mm. She's like learning as she pulls it up. Yeah. Some apples. Some kiwis. I got this. I had a sale on this. Rose water. That's a fucking lot of rose water. I have one bottle of rose water that I've had forever. What do you even do with it? I just put like drops in cocktails. I don't know, people like wash their hair with it and stuff. That or something shit like is that. potent. Rose water and water. Water. Rose water and orange blossom water are super fucking potent. Some Syria. And are you going to put some in a spray bottle? Use some on my skin for, you know, it's good for your skin. I think that you're a little past that point. Mm, and also to drink helps. a little bit in water. Okay. Yeah, no, they use drink. it a lot in like Arabic desserts. And we have. Exactly, John. She's like, who the fuck got asparagus? Some <laughs> shredded mozzarella, two pack. It's always on sale. This is their BJ's or whatever. Mm -hmm. Sam's Club, Costco. I don't like the way it mixes on my chicken wings. And random singing. Damn, we're racking them up already. Yeah. 
I mean, we did get Demon Cat Boys. <laughs> Holy moly. Huge cabbage. Jesus Christ. What are you going to do with that cabbage? It's like a toilet seat. That's huge. In this bag here, we have some bananas. She doesn't know it's in here. No. And some mango. <laughs> it's not very ripe right now. Hi. That was rat face, too. Damn, we're Amaroi racking them up. 11. It's like a fermented milk drink. Ew. It said almond on it, so these, I imagine I it's found these almond milk. Pickles from my, one of my favorite restaurants, remember? I found them in the store. I'm going to try them and see. If she how out of breath she got just moving? Wait, was, is this filmed before? Because she was eating those the last time we watched it. Yeah, her. this is pre-recorded. Oh, okay. Or did she just get more of them? We're going up to 1.25, or 1.5. They're the same. Let's try one now. Are these the expired ones? They're the same. Let's try one now. Um, Let's see. I like, think what she got a new jar. Favorite restaurant. Nope, those are the expired ones. Oh, uh, yeah. Remember? Found them in the store. I'm going to try them and see if they're the and same. So I'm Let's try one so much, now. he decided to go... Right to jail. Right to jail. <laughs> right away. Right to I just got back from the range for the first time. Every time my kitten runs past me in full zoomies, I tell her... Thank you for your input, Nebula. Aww. Aww, that's nice, cute. Sam. That's how exciting. Yeah, these are the ones that expired in August. Mm -hmm. I hope they're the same. I wonder if this is like half food bank, half groceries. No, this is groceries. Oh my gosh. They smell Because they got the same shit they always get. I don't know what vegetable this is. It's not a carrot. See? It's like weird. Hmm. <sighs> Yeah, it looks like you're enjoying it. Yeah, but then she goes on to rave about them and eat them like crazy. Some kind of root vegetable I've never seen. You would think at some point she'd pick up a little bit of Arabic. You would think. Yeah, Susan, and the date said August 2023. Barbican. Is that drink that they like? So, it's a non-alcoholic drink and it's strawberry flavor. <laughs> it's not time. All right, so first uh, up, we have some dried. Look how huge this dry raisin is. <laughs> dried cranberry. It's a prune. I was gonna say, aren't all raisins dried? Yes. These and dry raisins. Barbecue sunflower seeds. Barbecue cashews. Dry apricots. Dates. Whatever this is. Some kind of crispy cracker, spicy cracker. Oh, this is from that store they go to. Corn nuts. <laughs> Slice almonds to put in rice. Or seeds. I don't know what kind of seeds these are. If anyone knows, let me know. One kilo of... Oh, engagement farming. We're racking them in, man. Fresh, unsalted cashews. Okay, so we also got some non-grocery items. All right, so we have a two-pack here of these three-blade um, razors that have, like, the soap on them. And... If salad needs the... The fancy stuff for his feminine skin. Because mm -hmm. what the fuck does Chantel shave? I, she can't reach anything. Like she, It's not like she can reach her legs or anything to shave them. It's not happening. There are six in each pack, so 12. So these two were 82 cents. They're, you know, they're not the, the Venus brand, but they're like the knockoff and whatever, a razor's a razor. Um, and it's, um, yeah, 82 cents USD equivalent, like 250 pills per <coughs> She doesn't shave. She just doesn't shave, so. Salad likes the pink razors. Yeah, he needs the soap for his luscious skin. Mm-hmm. Electric hot water bag. All right, so we got um, an electric hot water bag. It can be hot or cold. Why? And uh, yeah, just good if you're not feeling well or you have a sore spot on your body. Yeah. Okay. This is weird stuff. Yeah, okay, this, this is, is the biggest bargain ever. Shit. Okay, check this out. Oh, and we got this only because it was on sale, guys. You get the sugar, blood sugar monitor. You get the lamp, the um, lancer, I guess you would call it. Uh, 50 lancets. Is that what they're called? Yeah, lancets. Um, blood glucose test strips. So. Yeah, they just happen to be all on sale. We just happened to buy a whole bunch of diabetic testing supplies f at the grocery store? There's 50 tests here with the expiry date and everything. Why? Um, why, would you, why would you get that? Yeah. So, that's an awesome deal. It was 3 KD and a half. That's like $11 US. Two bottles of disinfectant, Dettol. Uh, pine oil disinfectant. Didn't they just get this? Floor cleaner. For the kitchen floor and stuff. Bottle of dish soap. Lean brand. 
Like a little cooler bag. Pretty cute. For bringing whatever you want to keep. Pottery. Where did Salad steal this shit from? It's for her to put her insulin in. Or cold. Oh. Pretty cute, eh? Yep. Cool All right. right. I think that's about it for this haul. So, um, yeah. Um, the total of this haul was 64 KD. So that's around 211 US dollars. But I'll put all the conversions here somewhere, okay, for you guys. Different conversions so you can have an idea. I know you guys like that kind of thing. Um, so, yeah, every time we do groceries, uh, if it's a little different, we'll show you. It's exhausting doing groceries. Uh, anyway. It's exhausting sitting here opening groceries. Right? Fake gamer cat said, I've got a sleepy kitty in my lap making muffins. Aww. Oh, muffins are the best things kitties do. All right, that's it for this one. <clears throat> this I don't understand why she would show the diabetes supplies in the grocery video. Those didn't come from the grocery store. It's called foreshadowing, babe. And I, 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 I like the way that she thinks everything is so cheap. She's yeah. like, oh, it was only three KDs. Like, oh, wow, it's only $3. But then when she does the math, it, it was still as much as regular price would be. Yeah. Like, it's, oh, it was really only super cheap, but it, it wasn't, though. It was just less dollar amount where you're at, but still as much money as everywhere else. Where's your glucose meter? <laughs> Where's your diabetes? All right. Uh, Let's move on to the next one. We have about 600 people watching and 129 likes. That don't math. Uh, that don't math. Guys, smash that like button, share it out. Uh, social medias, the, the slabs down below. Uh, new donation of $25 that Shelly loves. Mm -mm. She does. Shelly absolutely loves it. It's really gross. All right, let's move on to the next one. Juicy roasted chicken and the cheesiest best chicken poutine. I thought poutine was french fries and gravy. It is. We're just putting chicken in it now? It's whatever she wants it to be. Okay. Are you guys ready for this Thanksgiving? Got a play for me? Maybe. Hello. Ooh, Damn booty it. Booty booties. <laughs> hey there, beezers. Want a personalized video from me to really you slow. that you can keep forever? Yeah, or maybe booties. a special shout out. Or... My food's getting cold. I'm getting annoyed. So... <laughs> what are you annoyed about? Didn't we do this video? I think we did. Yes, we did. That looks that plate of food looks very familiar. Yes, we did. You're right, we did do it. Okay, let's take two. And Mark. Smash a like, share it out, do the thing with the slabs and the stuff down below at twenty five dollars. We got a woo train. Miss Sin is four a woos from a veto. Oh. We are racking in the fucking bingo so far. Definitely oh my god content. Uh Yes, farts on Shelly. No new stream boss yet. No otter. Uh, X to doubt that it was just such a good deal. I had to have it. Yeah, you just need diabetes. I mean, when I go in the store and I see diabetes supplies on sale, I'm like, well, it's on sale. I better get that. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, yeah, if it's on sale, I better just buy it. All right, take two and post. Mac and cheese and chicken tender muck. Mac and cheese and chicken tender mukbang. Mmm. It sounds like a hell of a combo right there. Hello? Booty booties? <laughs> Hello, Beezer. Livy, you should check out the $25 donation. Oh. Mac, cheese, chicken tender, ketchup, pickle. Did two waters. Pickles and pickles and pickles. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So today I have something homemade that I'm super excited to eat. So the mac and cheese. What is this? Uh, some kind of spice, what probably. Is this stuff. These must be on this side. Chicken pour in her food. <laughs> mac and cheese and chicken strips. The chicken strips are frozen, but the mac and cheese is homemade. Um, so let me just. No, oh, you can't have any. Uh, for today's pickle plate, pickled mountain garlic and pickles. Water to drink. Okay, so let's say yum, Bismillah yum. and let's have a pickled garlic. Mm. It bugs me that she doesn't use her other hand to reach all the way over. It's weird. Because she needs it to kickstand her up. Yeah. Yeah. Like, that's where we're at. We are sitting on the floor leaning so hard on one hand that we have to... Uh, 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 over. Yes. <laughs> mm. That's the first time we've seen her with food that was actually warm. Whoa. 
What was that, foodie? It was hot. That wasn't hot. No, that was hot. That's what it looks like when you eat hot food. That's pain. Yeah, it was hot. That's Did you see it steaming? No, that's pain. You make that face when you bite into hot food, too. Mm. Uh, it is a little steamy. Yeah, it's hot. Why did she wait this long to react to it, though? Because she's chewing it, and it's hot. I wonder if she hit one of her ouchy teeth. Yeah, uh, maybe, but that's soft. Everyone says it's tooth pain. I think it's hot food. Chicken tenders aren't hard. No, you Shelly, think... she commented on it. What? That I heard it. The pain tooth. Oh, okay. Well, we haven't gotten there yet. I'll have barbecue sauce, so. I'm just gonna put a little bit of salt and pepper. Oh, a little? And try this out. I'm nervous. Let's try it here. I wanted it to be a little more saucy. That's hot. Mm hmm. Hot. Mmm. Oh, Kitty, come get some chicky chickies. Love some righteous cheese sauce, though. Righteous cheese sauce. Mm. I'll tell you how I made it. And I didn't film it. Because I was a hot. It's a kitty. Otter. That's doing come. Otter. Sweaty mess. <laughs> kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh, she's so. Sleepy. Hi. I gave you egg yolks. I've been giving her egg yolks. Giving cats egg yolks? You could give her some chicken. Do you think she cooks it? The egg yolk? Probably not. That can't be good for the cat. I don't think she should be giving that to the cat. That's probably not good for the cat. Which is apparently really healthy for cats. Not often, like maybe once or twice a week. It's supposed to help their coat as well. Anyway, how I made this is boil the noodles, put them in a baking dish, put sour cream, mix them with sour cream. I did, um... Sour cream? Susan says egg is good for cats. Sour cream? Maybe. I don't know. I never made homemade mac and cheese. I don't like mac and cheese. Sour cream and mac and cheese? Like, maybe more than half a stick of butter. A couple tablespoons of flour. Made a roux. Added milk, whole fat milk. Cream, maybe like a cup and a half of cream. Milk. Ever says egg yolks are good for Onion dogs powder, and cats. powder, salt, pepper. Spread it on the noodles when it got thick. And then added, like, topped with some, and added some, sorry. In the cheese sauce, I added the mozzarella cheese. I didn't have any cheddar. And also some Parmesan. And then I put uh, that over the top of the noodles, mixed it well. Put Parmesan, oh, yeah, um, okay. sprinkled some mozzarella cheese. I wish I had more, but I didn't have more. And some paprika. Put it in the oven on, like, 375. For I'm going to have food. paprika because she has a giant bag of paprika in the kitchen. <laughs> so everything gets paprika. No point. 15 minutes or so. <laughs> Um, 15, 20 minutes. And that's it. Mm. She can't wait two minutes for it to cool down. Or just blow on it. Very yummy. Oh, I, I wish I had one. I got one. I got one. I got a gray. Give us a mouth. Oh, that was a good little right. meow. Let me see if I can get the good mouth out of her. Oh, there it is. They give you the scratch. Meow. Come on. Get a meow. Okay. <laughs> Gotta give her the scratch. Right in the right spot. I don't really she like could use her double-ended neck fan to blow the food. They taste like... She don't like it. Uh-oh. Oh. Mm. Stops talking to eat. <laughs> That's a good square. It's basically free space. Anyway, we had a nice day. Did you? What'd you do? You sat in the house. So if you wouldn't wait, you'll know this, but... There's a bad flood in the Salmia area, Old Souk area, because it poured rain yesterday. And when it pours, it floods. Did you drink that any louder? Jeez. This is delicious. I've been craving it. Slurp, slurp. <coughs> okay, so 
it flooded somewhere in Kuwait, and Chantal's got to talk about it. Yeah. We had a good day because it flooded. Uh-huh. Like, is there more to this story? Probably not. Why are we bringing it up? What does it have to do with anything? Who gives a shit? <laughs> So, so what? Let me do it today. But Salah loves the rain. And Salah just likes to go out of the house. We went for a long drive. Oh, in your new car. I'm just gonna. Uh, uh, I already did X to doubt. To an area of Kuwait called Wafra. It's like pretty far away. Maybe like 45 minutes to an hour driving. Why'd you go there? Put on her favorite music and just... Bullshit, they she just drove. Like spent time together in the car. Bullshit, bullshit. She did all that driving without fucking... Vlogging it. Yeah, that's probably... That's it, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Oh, and if anybody's curious... I, I officially imported the uh, 6550 over here, just for Miss Sin. I don't know what that is. It's okay. No. He's trying to show me all the areas of Kuwait, and we're gonna take you guys on rides too. I want to show you like different parts. Well, you just went there today. Why didn't you film film it so we could see it? There's not much like in Wafra like to do. Oh my God, salad is the gorilla from Gorilla Regret. <laughs> no, because he wouldn't miss his wife after he threw her. Yeah, he would. I wouldn't. What's that? Forty something something. That's your. That is your actual favorite. Yeah, I do like that. But they had some pretty cool food trucks. We had lunch at, and he showed me like the farms, the royal farms, really fancy buildings. <gasps> so good. Mm. She looked at it on Google Maps. Probably. And Salad went to the red room. Uh huh. Smack and cheese, freeze well. Hi. Uh, I love you. I wish I filmed it, but sometimes we just go out, we don't feel like filming, you know? It takes the joy of life, always having I mean, Yeah, because on. holding your phone. Yeah. So, huh, so stressful. <laughs> but. Yeah, her eye has been just kind of walking away like the table did. <laughs> We went to this burger truck. One of the best burger, cheeseburgers I ever had. Mm. Mm. I don't know what they put with like caramelized onion, a brioche bun. The meat was so juicy. And t- she has. So they drove 45 minutes to get burgers. She has nothing to talk about. Uh uh-uh. uh. Just nothing. Tasty. I mean, if she was a food review channel, you think she would have showed this? Amazing burger. Yeah. Weird. I can't stand when beef tastes like a flat tire. <laughs> um, a bit with the crispy cheese. I will cook again. Do cooking videos again. She's really avoiding the chicken strips in favor of the Mac. For you guys, but I have yeah. to be in the right mood. And I feel like my kitchen has to be spotless, and I just like... I'd like some chicken strips. I don't like hopefully. chicken strips with ketchup anymore. I used to like with ketchup. No, I, I like, like barbecue. I only like honey mustard on chicken strips. I don't feel like making it spotless right now. I don't like mustard. Honey mustard doesn't taste like mustard. It's not filthy, but... Anyway. Mm. They're so good. I can't believe they're just like store-bought frozen section. I miss St. Hubert's chicken strips. St. Hubert's has some good chicken strips. Mm, okay. Is anybody else rationally irritated by the way she eats every meal with a gigantic spoon? I think that's the only spoon she has. It's so weird. I wish they made halal. The fruity sauce? She has like one plate set because she's probably the only one who eats food there. Yeah, that's true. Mmm. Delicious. Franken beans is correct. Honey mustard is the superior dimming sauce. 
I don't know if Salah will like it because he doesn't like his macaroni to be too busy. But that I mean, like, it's just got cheese on it. It's busy. Well, how's it busy? It's busy. <laughs> it's just macaroni with cheese on it. It's busy. <laughs> just I can't save any for salad. It's busy. He he's not gonna like it, so I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm gonna save it. Too many things. I need to get more of this. Hi. Hair gets in my eye. Gro you're gross. <laughs> How your ears are covered with your scuba gear. Oh, she's having a real hard time with whatever's happening. That face, that says a lot. <laughs> Just real quick and go ahead and grab that. Yeah, that's that's amazing and I love it. Thank you, Chantel. It's, so that's it's delicious. <laughs> it's fantastic, really. <laughs> like, there's good stuff, and then there's great stuff, and this is a great stuff. <laughs> and that is now in the Girl Stuff Discord, if you want to go check that out. <laughs> Sour. That face one, the cheese pull ain't pulling. <laughs> Livy says, also, do Marth. Thank you, Livy. That's why I face when I'm having a bad poo. Yeah, that's when you get a little blood on the paper. You, you yesterday, the face. At the park. <laughs> <laughs> Last night, we are out, and I look over at him, and he's making this face. I'm like, are you farting right now? He looked like a toddler, <laughs> like when they're standing in the corner pooping in their diaper, and they're making that face. Oh, my God, I almost died. You, you can't do that in public. <laughs> and I was like, you talk shit again. I'm going to go stand in front of the whole, like, band and do it. Good girl. <laughs> you, get, you get a little bit of skin. Out. Yeah, that's, 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 that's exactly what that face is. Mm. Yeah, I don't know why these pickles taste like, hold on. Pickles. Like plastic. Probably old. I don't know how to describe They weren't it. in juice. They were in a plastic Something tub chemical? and dry. They were not in juice. You're exactly right. They're not juicy pickles. They're like dry pickles. Yeah, they're they're just rotten cucumbers. Yeah. I don't think those would be good either, but I would not buy a box of dry pickles. I would buy pickles in a jar with juice. That cat needs a brush, Jesus. She brushes the cat every day. The cat looks like... Every single day, she brushes the cat. Growing dreadlocks. If our cats ever looked like that, I would freak the fuck out. I would brush them. But they're very good at cleaning themselves. They are. Especially Nuggy with his long fur. Mm -hmm. He sometimes gets mats, like, around under his neck. Other, By his all, collar? Yeah, all over, though. He's real silky and smooth. He keeps his fur real nice. He's very smooth. Otter's very poofy. Yeah, she's just a floof. Crispy cheese? Or burnt cheese? And Julia doesn't even look like a cat anymore. She's just a dust bunny. Aww. What's your favorite mac and cheese from where? Like store bought? None. Mac and cheese is awful. I love mac and cheese. I make my own mac and cheese though, so I just it's not It's too busy when you make it. You make it too busy. I do pepper jack and cheddar. Too busy. Sally can't eat that. Good, it's not for him. Of course. This wasn't for him either. That's why she made it too busy. No, honey, you won't like it. I made it very busy. Which is the Amer the Canadian version of mac and cheese in a box. But I could never perfect it. I think I burnt these ones too long in the air fryer. Oh. No, that's just a bad piece. You, you oh. don't eat those pieces. That's, that's a bad piece. That's all the, the tendon eat bits. Don't eat that piece. Oh. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Frank and Beans makes five cheese mac and cheese. That's too busy, Frank oh, and that's, Beans. That's way oh, too busy. That's good cheese. Way too busy. <laughs> The asymmetrical breading is like impaling my gums. Or stabbing my gums. Okay. Okay, you take another bite then. How do you make your box mac and cheese? Do you put... Okay. I know somebody who makes it with just butter. And the cheese powder. Some people like butter and milk and the cheese powder. Whatever the directions say. <laughs> I used to add butter, milk. And Parmesan cheese and ketchup. Why ketchup? Yeah, why ketchup? Yeah, asymmetrical a breading. That was that was a weird. That was weird. When it's... when is symmetrical? When are chicken nuggets ever symmetrical? It's pretty good mac and cheese. <laughs> I didn't even catch that. Oh jeez. Hello, have a sumo. Not to toot my own horn. Yeah. She's did, every bite is pain for her. Yeah, this this does look like the first couple bites I thought maybe it's just like ow, ooh, hot, ow, hot. But it's not hot anymore and she's still making the faces. <laughs> so the chicken's probably rock hard and she's just chomping through it. <laughs> it's probably first off, it's probably terrible tasting chicken. Mm -hmm. So she overcooked it cuz you can see it's kind of burnt on some of the pieces. Yeah. And, you know, she's got not the greatest teeth. Yeah, no. And so when she bites into it, it's probably just pain in every bite. Mm -hmm. That would be my chicken brand. Since chicken, pain in every bite. <laughs> we have to use asymmetrical breading to get it like that. Breading isn't the only asymmetrical thing. <laughs> Let's try this. Look at the thought process forming on her head. Like, hmm? Hmm. 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 Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let's try this. Do you think the mac and cheese will soften it up some? Mm. Well, see, the problem is she's doing too much chewing. Usually it's just chew, chew, swallow. Yeah. So she's doing the extra chew, so it's bothering her teeth. She looks very... She's not happy. She looks like an angry grandma. She looks very handsome here. Like, uh, grandma's real disappointed. Brought home a bad report card. You know you've what been she... staying out all night, you and grandma is angry. You got three Fs and a D. <laughs> and you're getting lippy. <laughs> Like the lipstick all worn out. Like she, she reminds me of my grandma. She looks, <laughs> she looks like Tony Soprano's mom, as a personality. <laughs> I should make a book of recipes. Oh yeah. With my church basement spaghetti. Burnt chicken and busy mac oh. and cheese. A lot of people are like, "What is church basement spaghetti?" BC BMC. Okay. That's what it is. The BC BMC. Okay. Burnt chicken, busy mac and cheese. Yep. For those who don't know, it's your basic church function spaghetti. Now, I grew up Catholic. And as a result, I went to an elementary school that was Catholic. And we had a church beside our school. And our school would have different, like, extracurricular functions. You know, on weekends or after school. Sometimes they would have a pancake breakfast on Saturdays or Sundays. Like, I'm not going to school even for pancakes on a weekend. No, I can just put some eggs. I'm so unique. I don't like going to things. They go right. in the freaking toaster. <laughs> Actually, it was toaster strudels I used to love. But they don't give you enough icing. Anyway, so church basement spaghetti. I can agree with that. Toaster strudels never gave enough icing. Spaghetti night. Okay. Stop talking to eat again. 
I can click it. She she's told this story like a million times too. Oh, she has new followers now. She has to tell them. The industrial pickles. <laughs> You know you don't have to eat them, right? She's gonna yell at Salad for buying the wrong pickles. She, look, even the pickles hurt. Look. She's mad about them pickles. And they, you know, I went to one of these because I like spaghetti. Livy said she'll take your mac and cheese. You can have my mac and cheese, Livy. I want Livy, I make a delicious buffalo mac and cheese. It's good. Yeah. And my friends are going. I don't think she ever cleans her plate. I think she just licks them and puts it back. Do you mind? So I went. And they have like, you take a plate. And they have a big vat of noodles. Big vat of like, prego and ground beef. That's like the ba most basic spaghetti you can make. But it's so good. Parm? No. You have to bring your own parm. BYOP. <laughs> <laughs> Buffalo Mac, sin. I'm coming over. Make Shelly sleep on the couch. All right, Sam. <laughs> they gave you a little dinner roll with no butter. I remember one of the bad kids in class in the lineup was like, "She's got the fine motor skills of a toddler." Uh -huh. No butter, Agnes. And she was like, "I don't want to say his name, but." Uh, let's say Sean. Sean, butter's expensive here. We're a church. How are you poor when you get donations every mass? <laughs> no. Oh, here oh, we go. Boy. Are we mad about churches getting yeah. donations? We're, we're mad now, about this Catholics. Is, is this is going to be about. a theme from here on out. She's mm -hmm. going to get mad about people getting money. So something she hates happened. charities. All of it is bad. Something happened where she either her paycheck isn't as good as she was expecting or something. But she is very, very bothered about money going forward. Mm -hmm. What was her okay. last thing was her raging about people getting tips for their hard work. Like yeah. She, she does not like anything like that. Anything that's a, a charity or being generous, she doesn't want to hear it. No, God no. How dare it's anyone like, get generosity or be generous? No. How dare anybody but her get money? Right. I bet you that chicken's overcooked and it's Rick hard. Yes. You it don't looks even have to Rick pay taxes. Hard. You pass around the basket, you get tons of money. I mean, the church is pretty opulent. And you can't even afford butter. One stick, come on. We're it. <laughs> anyway. Don't hate me, I'm just pointing it out. You just said you were bringing your own Parmesan cheese. Why don't you bring your own butter then? So anytime I make basic spaghetti, because you can make fancy spaghetti. Some people like simmer their sauce all day, add red wine, fresh herbs. This is brown your ground beef, add two jars of pasta sauce, and let... Well, that's true, Frankenbeans. A lot of charities are scams. Yes. But who was she to dictate what a church does with their tithe. Right, they should be buying butter for me and my rolls. They cook through until warm and you're good to go. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. And the free meal is not good enough. Yeah. It's not okay that the church bought the whole free meal she's, that she got to eat. She didn't get butter. She's How dare they? Getting a free meal and this <laughs> fucking bitch is mad <laughs> that there wasn't extra butter. I am so full. Because mac and cheese and how is so bizarre to remember when I was eight years old, I got a roll without butter. Like, would you remember not getting butter on your roll at the spaghetti church dinner when you were eight? No. <laughs> what a bizarre, like either she makes this up or she actually remembers every time anyone slighted her about food in her life. Probably the latter. Yeah. So rich and then the noodles. Oh my gosh. Mac and cheese coma. Yeah. And she was mad at the guy in Cuba about asking for relish. Like he just asked, is there relish? And she went on a rager about white people wanting relish. <laughs> so weird. God, that eye is wandering. Look at that. Mm -hmm. That's not great. <laughs> I guess I have to freeze. There's like so much left. I'll probably just freeze it, I guess. Eat some for lunch tomorrow. Freeze the rest. I don't know. 
So that was really good. I think I prefer it with smaller noodles, but I had a bag of huge noodles I've had forever because we all prefer the small noodles. I don't even know why. Right. I prefer it with smaller noodles, but I had a bag of huge noodles I've had forever because we all prefer the now, now she's mad about the kind of noodles that were in her mac and cheese that she moured down, like every single crumb of it. And, but no, I don't like those noodles. The the I, the all of it I do be wandering. Yeah, it definitely is going somewhere. For the small noodles, I don't even know why I got a huge bag, <laughs> like a bag of large noodles. When it comes to pasta, I like smaller noodles, like spaghetti, spaghetti spaghettini, little elbow macaroni. Didn't stop Didn't you from eating it though, ma'am. Like big pasta. What do you guys like? It wasn't even That's a big I pasta. Like homemade, I don't like homemade It was ravioli. like shells, wasn't it? It looked like shells. I like the Chef Boyardee ravioli in a can only. Otherwise, I don't like it. I don't know why. So she likes anyway, it to taste like metal. I guess that's it for this video, guys. Um, well, that was quality enjoyed. content. Sorry I didn't cook it for you on camera. I hope you understand. Just, I mean, I was already hot as it was cooking without hijab. If Look I, at her struggle breathing, too. Mm -hmm. If I you know, had hijab on, it would be a disaster. But I will try to, uh, to cook one of these days. So, anyway, I wanted to share that with you anyway. I at least told you the recipe. <laughs> oh, that's so. why she's not cooking, because she's too hot. She wants to cook naked in the I kitchen. Think she's, I think she's cooking naked. Yeah. That's good enough, I think. <laughs> she's in there naked with her neck fan. Also, Sal is hiding. <laughs> it's tasty. Dang, son. Really? You like it? Yeah, Uh-oh, is... salad likes the busy mac and cheese. Oh, no, he's going to eat more. Salad is cringe. It was tasty. Damn, son. Yeah. Damn, son, that was tasty. Another success. <laughs> okay, that's it for this one. All right, now we're going to get to the Ragers because she has been on one uh -oh. for a couple of days. So we will do this all in uh, uh, chronological order. But before we do that, guys, smash that like button. We have 660 people watching and 180 likes. What? That does not math. That's not even close math, guys. Smash guys, that like button. Push the button. Share it out on your social media, uh, should you feel so inclined. Streamlabs is listed down below. We are 18% to goal. We have 11 on the train, 15 for Miss Cindy to get a veto. Ooh. And she will need a veto. <sighs> it, it It's just a fact. She will need them. Oh, yeah, we did have religion talk, didn't we? <laughs> We've got one bingo. Um, I'll do all this in a little bit. Place with food. Oh, yeah, we had a lot of that. Over here. Let's get a big all hail blue whale out there. Oh, I'll have a blue whale. We're looking for a stream goal. Shelly threatening to call the cops. I think one more of those 25 might do it. Uh, uh... <laughs> Dragon Ball, Shelly in charge, neighbor shenanery, gym talk. I have changed what I do. I'm now on a pyramid. I go 12, 10, 8, 6, 4. And my chest is still sore from last Monday, so I might need to move some stuff around this week going forward. Uh, new stream boss. Not yet, but you're chipping away at Luna's health. No movie reference. Get definitely had a thumbnail. Have we had a club? No, not in a long time. Mm, I mean, we do have new pinky song. That's true. Uh, no squee, no politics, and uh, no Eevee. Okay. I think he's outside. So I'm not going to read this one because I thought it was absolutely disgusting and a horrible thing to write on your community tab about the parent, an ex-partner who was the parent of their children doing all this shit and then passing away <laughs> as a way to one-up somebody. That's weird. This was truly, truly disgusting. And I see many times hear her talking about kids this, kids that. So here we got talks about kids on the bingo. Yeah, she brings up kids a lot in this. Saying how everyone's a degenerate. And uh, you're way bigger losers. because So she's calling Salad a loser. Well, we might be losers, oh, but yeah. you're way bigger losers. You're a bigger loser, okay. Uh, talking about someone who's deceased as low, you mean how... Yabba spoke about Lil Mama's husband after her passing. This, I don't remember any of this happening. I'm not saying it did, but, uh, okay. Uh, you make up crap about Salah, and I, so she's pretty much mad about Salad. Yeah. Uh, talking vile things about our bodies, speculating on our sex life. No, you just don't have sex. Y yeah, you guys don't like each other. Well, you like him, but he doesn't like you, and it's okay. We can see it. Yeah, she really did think it was some kind of a dunk. But it wasn't. 
No, that that's just gross. This Send a gross. spoonful of baking soda and water daily. Lactic acid, because your pH is high. What? Maybe that's why your muscles are sore. Oh, mate, no, not like sore, muscle sore, not like the burny sore. Okay. And then here uh, we go to this one. Also going to leave this here so the newbies, you know, this new audience she thinks she has, can listen to my story themselves. There's no point in addressing brain-dead zombie followers, these idiots making up rumors about what happened. Last time, I address it. And I won't talk about drama. Oh, yeah. We talk about this <laughs> once a week. <laughs> Last time, I'll address it. And believe a certain someone will have a civil case in the future. Uh-huh. If you think I'm going to let somebody steal my cat and then use her to defame me, wrong. 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 <laughs> I thought, there's no way I'm going to let her. That's my cat. It's a great cat. I was the best cat owner. <laughs> wrong. I am patient, but I won't back down. Not cutting an elderly cat's nails. It happens. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was the greatest cat owner. Uh, which grows super fast. Which grows super fast, apparently, compared to younger cats. I'm just, I'm just learning this right now. I had no idea. No one I, ever told me that before. <laughs> this is the first time I've heard this before. No one's ever said this to me. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> Which is why Sam's nails, fine. F fabulous nails. <laughs> fabulous cat, fabulous nails. <laughs> While being... Don't do that. <laughs> yeah, don't do that. While being out of country... He you is doing the accordion. Yes. <laughs> you have to. <laughs> He's doing the accordion. <laughs> An elderly cat with problems also doesn't make something something. Keeping a suffering emaciated... An emaciated cat. Cat alive for clout also makes you an abuser. Also, animal control came three times. Why is animal control coming? I, this makes no sense to me. They are the ones who like come get wild animals that are caught in your yard, not come to check on animal behavior. That's also true. And when that happened, I remember it was just they left a note on the door. Yeah, no one ever answered. Right. Uh, no neglect or abuse. Fraud. <laughs> Fraud. It's rigged. No neglect. No abuse. I was a great cat owner. Fraud. <laughs> <laughs> One of those while I was in Kuwait. So uh, I have to bring that back up. I also have you, moron, admitting to the scheme to get my cat. So thanks for being done and incriminating yourself. Jeff's kiss. Fake news. <laughs> it's fake news media lying to you. She stole my cat. She stole the election. She stole my cat. <laughs> it's rigged. <laughs> <laughs> and we got more. Edit. Even the base model is 30K. Look it up. No. Look it up. Our car is a cheap Timu car. <laughs> The automotive industry here just isn't the same. You know, <laughs> we shipped all these jobs to China and they make these Tigo, Timu, the Tiger. The best frankly, the shit. No, they're the best cars, clearly. 33,000 Canadian dollars. Clearly the best cars. 33,000 Canadian dollars, all right? Yes, you can finance, but the reality is you have no idea our situation, but you can keep being wrong. 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 <laughs> wrong. <laughs> it's funny to point out how <laughs> bitter people are sounding. If you have no other content than to obsessively try to contrive dumb theories about who was paying 
<laughs> how we're paying for it, etc., etc., etc. You really, really need a life. Stop worrying about ours because you will never know our private lives. We owe you nothing. Mm. 33000 is very cheap for a car. That's brand new. <laughs> Custom car. Brand new this year. That's very, very cheap. Yeah. That's extremely cheap. And it's not 30000 It's fucking not. We looked it up. It was like 20000 American. Yeah, hers was not the Pro Max. Hers was just the Pro. Yeah, it was like twenty fifteen to 20000 American. But you know what? I might have an 09 truck, but I don't have a custom fire extinguisher. No, <laughs> like, you don't. For when it just inevitably catches on fire. I just I don't have a fucking custom fire extinguisher. Right. So your car's not not nearly as fancy. I mean my car's <laughs> not as fancy either. And it also didn't come with fire extinguisher. I mean it is a cute car, Chantel. It's cute, but just admit, yeah, it might catch on fire, but we like it. That's fine. Just say that. We can afford it. We like it. If it catches on fire, we have the warranty. Problem solved. Uh, happy sinful Sunday, guys. I hope you're well. Uh, staying away from the germ gremlins we call children. Nice. Uh, they got the sick flu bug going around like crazy. Not caring much about Chantel since she brings it on herself. But I'm here for you too. Thank you so much, Liz. I appreciate that. Thank you. Very Liz. generous yes. Zephyr. I don't have much, but please take this. I love you guys. You make my Sunday my fun day. Aww. Thank you so much, Zephyr. I appreciate the two buckaroos. I wish Chantel would stop making threats. First of all, she's too lazy to follow through with any threats. Second true. of all, uh, she may be able to bat away animal abuse accusations made by FFG, but not a trained veterinary staff. That is true. It was on the paperwork. That's a fact. Thank you, guys. Uh, we are 12 on the train. We are 19% to goal. We have 20% left. A bunch of donate... Or don uh, one new donate. Well, a bunch of new ones, but one really good new one. A bunch of bingos left. And the final rage post. Thanks to whoever sent me this. At the 5403 mark, I say I cut PBG's, na PBJ's nails. So that means it happened and you can't say it anymore. Yeah, you, you lie about it all the time, though. <laughs> I say I cut them in October. And this proves that I cut her nails. Right. Uh, I think they didn't overgrow uh, while I was away. I knew they needed to be cut when I got home. But as I said, I had a video chat with Pete's mid-trip. I doubt this happened. Okay, even if she did, she got home. She, she, was reg she had a video chat with Pete's just to check the nails. And then got home. But didn't think to check the nails for a month and a half after she got home. Because she could have took the cat right to get the nails clipped right when she got home. Yeah, but she didn't. And she didn't even I bother doubt, to check. I 100% doubt she cut them, too. No, she didn't. Uh, she probably said, we need to get the nails cut, or I'm going to get the nails. I don't even need to see the video. It probably is, I'm going to. And it never happened. Yeah, this proves I wasn't lying about that. If you believe the moronic reactors at this point on anything they say, you are truly a brainwashed zombie. Anyway, I'm done explaining and trying to prove anything. It's exhausting and not worth my time by the way she turned off the comments on oh, everything she claimed in that one she now takes julia every three months for a nail trim why every three weeks for a nail trim i thought young 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 cats they have the best nails the greatest best nails of any cats they're young they're, they're they young, don't need a nail trim. they have why is why is julia going every three fabulous weeks? nails they they need no attention they just do it themselves and i thought that's great i thought that's a great cat she does her own nails i love it so weird but this led into this which was this thumbnail beef stew with a twist cry bullies what is that picture a bull a crying demon i don't know but it we have a, a a whiny rage yeah she won't even take the cat to get fixed she's not taking it to get a nail trim every three weeks mm -hmm. then it would have had its vaccinations what groomer is letting you take an unvaccinated cat to get groomed? None. Literally none. Every groomer I've tried to take Eve to, they go, does she have her shots? I right, go, even yeah. if you're a little bit behind on the rabies, they're oh. like, oh, nope. Yeah. It's, it's, she's due for a rabies shot a week ago. You better go get her, and then we'll yep. groom her. That, that's just how it is. So we have shame somebody, rage binge, block someone in chat, rants about haters. You know what I mean? We are almost at a foodie blackout. We are. We are all we are riding a foodie blackout here. Uh, guys, smash a like, share it out, 
uh, slabs down below, gold, the, the Awu train, Miss Sin needs vetoes, we're good, let's go. Yeah. What I said. Mm hmm All those things. Hello, foodie booty. Booty. <laughs> there, Beezers. Want a personalized... And I saw on Twitter it was going around that uh, her cameo still has like 12 stars, so she hasn't gotten any since like June. Aww. Hope to hear from you. Bye. That cat is the cutest baby. Please brush her. No. Yeah, that cat is not. That cat's freaking adorable. Hello, guys. She, Hello. She just needs a brush. Welcome back to another video. I'm super hungry. I'm supposed to cool off a bit. So, anyways, Bismillah. Um, this is, um... Wasn't this the, the food she made with BB? I don't know, but it looks like it has those gross... Mountain garlics in it. That's disgusting. Mafe, or which is a West African dish, but and you guys have seen me make this before. It's always a recipe that's it's from my past, but it stuck with me, and I love to make it once in a while. Yeah, I crave it. Past, it must be um, it's basically just beef stew beef. with um, tomato Ooh. and peanut. Now, how I make it is while it's cooling off, um, I saute, I fry the beef with oil on like medium high, get it nice and brown, and then I add the onions. Um, tomato paste and I fry that till the tomato paste gets like darker red. You don't want it to be too like tangy and then uh, Should I make a recipe ebook and I fry that till the tomato paste gets like darker. her recipes are just other people's recipes. Yes And it's poutine without the ingredients and This which was a pretty widely known recipe mm -hmm. Red you don't want it to be too like tangy and then um I add water, you know, to cover the, the meat and, and give it enough time to, like, I let it simmer for like a good, maybe like at least a half an hour, maybe 35. Yeah, you can already tell she's mad. She's out of breath. The eye is wonky. Yep. Five minutes or so. Then I add the root vegetables. Now I add tomatoes and potatoes, but you can add whatever you want. Um, yams, oh, whatever. Maybe it's potatoes. Sweet potato is nice in this actually. And then I add a bit more water, let that cook down for another half an hour. Then the last part I add, um, the beef bouillon, some Worcestershire sauce. Uh, although the original recipe doesn't call for that, but you can. Mod God, the dog's barking. Dog. I'm glad to know that's potatoes and not the mountain garlic. I was you scared know, that she put want. pickles in it. Um, I add peanut butter, and Can the peanut it, butter doesn't taste yes. like peanut butter in the sauce. It makes it nice and thick and like smooth. I don't know, creamy kind of. Um, it thickens it, adds a nice flavor profile. So yeah. So then the I cook that for another cheeky, half an hour until the oil separates probably from the peanut butter and the oil that I cooked with, on the top. Pe peanut butter? Wait, there's, there's peanut butter in here? And um, then you're, you're, oh, and then I add, the last part, I add some white cabbage, like a wedge of white cabbage inside. Hey, Dystonic, how you doing? Uh, and then uh, let it cook for maybe another five, five, seven minutes, and it's good to go. And I have some rice here. I have basmati. And I have... I have ba has Matty. She's the wheelchair kid from Malcolm in the Middle. And uh, the beef cubes, yeah, they're very tender. It's almost like slow cooker. They've been cooking for an hour and a half. You know, that's the trick with beef. You have to let it cook. Be uh oh. Oh lord, she coming. Let's get that woo. Hi, big fat moose. You gonna give me a woo? You just gonna steal mom's spot? No. Give me a woo. Oh, you can't have this one. You can have a green one. Okay, a blue one. <laughs> so excited! Oh. Come on, like you mean it. Big woo. No, big. Oh. Good girl. Woo. Oh, she dropped right, it. Move, Fatty. Try to get it. She just wants to give her another one. <laughs> she got dropped that one. I can't get it, Dad. <laughs> Where'd you drop it? <laughs> oh no. There it is, dummy. Where's my where's that beef jerky I got? Oh, give me some beef jerky. This is a different one. It is. Oh, give me some. Desert fire hot. Well, why would you get fire hot? Eve's not gonna like that. You know what she will eat though? No, she's yeah. not getting a she give her one. Wait, I gotta pick a flavor it. I don't like. Let go. Purple. Don't you give her one of the flavors I like? Tell me. Tell me. <clears throat> Here. Okay. Give her my Nico wafers. Beef cube. My favorite part is the carrots. So yeah, you let it cook low and slow. Give me that. Nice and tender. So. 
I will. Okay, you're, you have to split a little piece with Eve. Eve's not gonna like it. That's why I said a little piece. Eve, you're not gonna like it spicy. Can, can we have a serious conversation about how the hell beef jerky is so expensive? Yeah, it's it's a scam. You know, I, was, I was talking to my brother. Thanks God, Biden. Eve, do you mind? <laughs> what? That was my bite, Eve. <laughs> Oh my god, Chantel's face. <laughs> that was your face just now. The dog took your bite of beef jerky. I was trying to hand it to Miss Sid. And you just walked by a hump right out of my hand. I, I'm crying. <coughs> oh wow. I'm fucking crying. <laughs> Doll bunny, you have to have no spaces in your name. Yeah, you can't have any spaces. Maybe slabs is just down, but I, I just, you can't have any space. <laughs> oh, man, I'm crying. That was fucking hilarious. Hey, that's too spicy. You don't like it. She doesn't care. She's like, we got more? Like, I'll take more. He give more? A cult of curl. Beef jerky is expensive, even at Costco. I was talking to my brother about it yesterday. Him and I just spent the day together. Miss Sin calls me at like 6 o'clock. She's like... You've been at the bar for eight hours. Mm -hmm. And I was like, yeah. Are it's been eight hours? <laughs> <laughs> like, it's been eight hours? <laughs> but um, he said he knows a guy who makes beef jerky. He's like, for every 10 pounds that you put in there, you'll get three pounds of jerky out of it. Oh, yeah, because it, like, shrivels down. Yeah. I guess it makes sense. And Still shouldn't be that expensive. No. Anyway, sorry for the little break in oh my gosh delicious mm. the cougar knife cougar knife having your food fed to eve isn't fun is it shelly no no but i i didn't <laughs> feed it to eve he did <laughs> i know she likes the black ones i love it <laughs> Eve's reign of terror continues. So anyway, so yeah, I've just been uh, cooking today. I'm thinking of making oatmeal raisin cookies. What's your go-to jerky sinatra? I like the Gold Rush. I think that's a local brand. Teriyaki. You know, like bacon cookies? Just oh, makes the uh, I, I like the hot, mild or hot. It's also like comforting. I don't know. And cooking this smells great. Um, um, Dragon Child. You have a cleaning kind of. jerky to the P.O. box. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take some chicken teriyaki, please. We've been just living very uneventful lives. And, um... I mean, I get no more Did you just say chicken teriyaki? Oh, well, yeah, teriyaki flavor. Chicken teriyaki flavor. <laughs> don't, don't let Miss Sin make choices like this. <laughs> this is way out of her range. Which is why we're so, like, dumbfounded. The amount of people on the internet who... Look at how she's talking. The amount of people on the internet. Yeah, we're so, like dumbfounded the amount of people on the internet what is this what are you doing what is happening here hello Peter? what who just dumbfounded the amount of people on the internet there are a lot of people on the internet why are you making these faces she's angry grandma who just have to make so much drama out of our lives. See, look at this. I can't. I'll, I'll point this out forever. Have to make so much. What? Like she didn't even realize. Like half of her face isn't working. No, she has no idea. It's like she's going full Elvis. Mm -hmm. Drama out of our lives that are just so boring now. You know what I mean? I don't think we're making. Like, I get drama it. You need to feed your kids out of Chantel's life i think we're just laughing at her oh, yeah we're just here for the show with hate money but uh snowing wine drops that's a cute name welcome to plebs thank you thank you thank you i don't know how you live with yourselves really just uh i've had i think none your business sent me a bunch of different jerky it was like alligator jerky and kangaroo jerky and shit it was so fucking good just like i'd really like to know 
why it's okay for these people. And, and if you think that I'm the unhinged one, go on these hate channels and look at their video list. Uh, let me pull this back real quick. Uh, random question, is everyone's area, I think you meant area, got Amazon doing delivery super early. They are ramp. I was getting on the highway the other day. It must have been by an Amazon facility. And there were, and I'm not joking, 30 trucks wow. at a Sheets gas station. And this was at like 10 in the morning. So they're ju they they are just ramping up right now because we're getting into the holidays. Oh yeah, but they do do like when you when you check delivery, you can like pay the extra two dollars or whatever to have it delivered tomorrow before eight a.m. So they're out in the middle of the night delivering. It's, and sometimes they just do that. Mm -hmm. Like I I got you a was it a lingerie set kind of thing that red thing. Oh yeah, yeah. and that got like seven a.m. Yeah, really, just like. <clears throat> I'd really like to know why it's okay for these people. And, and if you think that I'm the unhinged one, go on these hate channels and look at their video list. I got, hold on, I got to pull this back again. Sorry. Um, yeah, we've just been cleaning, kind of. We've been just... Excuse you, ma'am. These are my Nikos. uneventful lives. If I find and, another uh, black one, you can have it. But it's people. <laughs> Which is why we're Don't so, like, dumbfounded. The amount of people the on the internet who just have to make so much drama out of our lives that are just so boring now. You know what I mean? Your life is boring now. That's like, true. I get it. You need to feed your kids with hate money, but... Feed your kids with hate money. Mm, at least they have kids to feed. Mm-hmm. Feed your guys if you want to help us. Hold on, <laughs> talk to the chef first. Uh, this food is so 94. good for her diabetes. That's true. This looks like a very healthy diabetes dish. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no fancy deliveries, Zenny Biscuit. A day late from I hate when Amazon acts like something's on time and then they're like, oh, rescheduled till we don't know when. <laughs> hate money kid food. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> Change the stream goal up above. To hate money kid food. <laughs> if you guys want to give us some hate money kid food, stream us down below. <laughs> Even just a spite bucker too. I don't know how you live with yourselves, really. Just like, I'd really like to know why it's okay for these people. And and if you think that I'm the unhinged one, go on you these are. hate channels and look I, at. I mean, the... you definitely are. Mm -hmm. You one hundred percent are the unhinged one here. <laughs> how do you not see that? Their video list. They have thousands for years of videos picking me apart, saying disgusting things about me and my husband, like, you, how do they sleep together? All they don't. You don't. It doesn't happen. Nobody, nobody is saying, how do you sleep together? Like, we're analyzing how it could be physically possible. I mean, that's a question all of it in its own. Nobody's asking that because everybody knows Salad doesn't even let you touch him. Too many sinlets need food. Eve keeps taking it all. That's true. Y'all are my favorite hate channel. Thank you. <laughs> All these disgusting things about our bodies. Uh, he's a user. Yes. All it's not hateful to point out reality. And it's not hateful to laugh at things that somebody puts on the internet for other people's entertainment. Literally everyone can see that he's using you, except you. Mm -hmm. All unfounded claims they have no proof for whatsoever. No proof. We don't need proof. We can see. Ever? From what you post for us to look at. I mean, we could bust out MS Paint if you want to. I don't know. They act like they're living with us. It's so invasive. <laughs> Dystonic diaries. How do you sleep at night with a fan on, bitch? <laughs> you know nothing. I hate to tell you, but you are all idiots. Wrong. Fake news. It's all rigged. Fake news, reaction channel, media, lying about everything. <laughs> they look at me and they think that's an easy target. But I'm not. <laughs> you are. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Uh, you too can help a hungry child in a poor, impoverished, 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 a poor, impoverished country. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
I, I thought I was just screwing up the reading. You too can help a poor, impoverished country. Donate your hate money today. Help feed those poor children that are desperate, desperately in need. Every little cent goes a long way to make a change. La, la mau, I had to think. Thank you, Liz. <laughs> Poverty. That was good. <laughs> One away from a veto. Along with your entire audience. Impoverished. Chantel, the reason people watch you is the same. Remember when I on the highway after an accident? That's true. Mm -hmm. We like to watch tragedies from the day we were born. The only reason you... Yes. Thank you, Gary. Because some of the things they say, like... I love a smug attitude from someone who's going to be lucky to see... <laughs> Insane. Um... I don't know if people are just obviously mad that I'm just living a, a good life now. Like, What ratio of love-hate love, do you feed the kids? You know, but... <laughs> Why is it okay for these people with the thousands of videos about us? Every day, we sit back, we say nothing. We live our lives. You say nothing, you live your lives. You make hate videos about reactors every day. You make hate posts. You make whole animated hate parody things. What are you I mean, talking about? You just sit back and ignore it. You feed into it every day. It's a little back and forth thing that you do with the reactors that you don't like. Exactly. I mean, that's exactly what it is. The doctors recommend a 70-30. I always found the 70-30 to be a little fatty. 85-15 is usually where I go. Yeah. But when I retort once or twice, they cry. They cry. Only once or twice. They don't cry. They laugh at you. They <laughs> laugh hysterically at you. It's not crying. But that's the thing. Is I think FFG... I, I must have had her on in the background or something. And it was during this video. And she was talking about this. And she goes, you know, she really thinks she does something uh -huh. with those little animated videos she makes. But what she doesn't realize is that she'll get a couple of thousand views off of it. But everybody gets to make fun of it. Everybody's yep. going to tear it apart. Right. They turn around and cry and make more content and more content out of it. Oh, uh, right. that's what it was. <laughs> she cannot conceal her feelings at all. No. It's like my feelings of it, it'll it, excitement, excitement, elatement, maybe that we are twenty percent to gold. Mm -hmm. That's oh, yeah, it. she she. Uh, that's her eyes looking at the twenty percent gold. And these fucking haters. That's true. She uh, you know, I forget what I was gonna say. Damn you! I forget what I was gonna say. Damn you! All right, never mind. Here's, here's something that'll chirp you up. There's peanut butter in there. There is not. Yep. That's disgusting. <laughs> ah, when salad pinches your cheeks. Don't touch my cheek. Don't touch my cheek. Just a, little, pin just a cheek. little pinch. No, I don't like it. Just a little pinch. Don't touch my just face. Just a little pinch. Need help. That's pinching my cheek. Oh my God. Why you gotta get her all riled up? Because she likes to help mom. She's my rescue dog. What's furthermore is the things they discuss are none of their business. No, it's it's everyone's business when you put it on the internet and when you come <laughs> on the internet and you like vaguely hint at this or that or whatever people are going to speculate you know you bring stuff up you don't say anything right. and then we speculate and you go you a bunch of bullies just making things up no we're just speculating because you want to be private like like our sex life like we are a muslim couple <laughs> Livy's right you don't have a sex life stop little pinch little pinch and we are very private about that that's none of your business like, what kind of adult person? Nobody wants to know. It's not our business. No one wants to hear about the... Even if it existed, we would not want to hear about your sex life. That's not the point. No one's asking you to give details of your I, sex life. We're just acknowledging no. that there's zero chemistry between you two. Asks these kinds of questions. What are you teaching your children by acting this way in front of them? Do you think, oh, do you the think fucking that... fucking kids. Wait, I mean, I, well, our kids are just sitting right here in the room. We're teaching well, the them. The fat one is. We're teaching them to watch the internet and ask about how people have sex with each other. That's what we're teaching our children, clearly. Like, what? Lay down. <laughs> get out of there. I'm going to get... Who is, who is watching Foodie Booty with their kids and making reactions? This is... Ready, little Jimmy? This is how we, this is how we react to people on the internet. Watch mommy do You're what baby. I do. I'm gonna set you on my lap and now watch me just be mean. In front of them, I'd really like to know. It's really gross. 
Um, people just not moving on from my past, even though I have. It's really weird. You have not. You you reminisce about how much you miss your past all the time. You, you come on here crying about it. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, once in a while, I think I have the right to point out hypocrisies. Yeah, no one's so saying you can't. People. No one's saying you can't point out hypocrisies. That is perfectly fine. In fact, I like when I like these videos because they're hilarious. Mm-hmm. But you can't say this inane, off the wall shit. Like, look up this brand new thirty thousand dollar car when we can clearly see it's like twenty grand brand new and it's recalled in like three fucking continents because it catches on fire. Yeah. It like we can see this. This is right here in front of our eyes. You can't get mad at us for noticing this. No, looking at it is wrong. Yeah, and she's still bringing up Natter, which is like two years ago. Mm -hmm. She's been married for a full year, still talking about her ex. Like somebody with a bad past of choosing partners, commenting on my husband with no proof of anything. Oh, we're talking about other people's choice of partners has no right to comment on her husband. It, and it, you and your husband put yourselves on the internet, ma'am. If you don't want people to look at you, talk about you, speculate about your life, don't put it on the internet. Mm -hmm. She's mad that the only content that she has is her sitting in front of food, driving around with her husband, and that's it. And other people can just watch her for content. Other people can just do other things on the internet other than just eat. Yeah. But she can't figure out anything else to do. She could make reactions to FFG. Mm -hmm. She could make her little animations. There's a million things she could do other than just sit and eat. But she doesn't have the motivation. Could. 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 She could, but she won't. Doesn't. Uh, Shrek veto money for Shelly. Thank you, Grumpy Fluffy Bunny. There's your 15. Thank you. One veto. Woohoo. 15 on the Awu train. So Log is very providing. He's very loving. He's not abusive. And the rest is not your business. Okay, then don't talk about your relationship online. Right. Uh, the only time Chantel rolls her eyes back in a happy way is when the fork is in here. So, and, and that's getting close. And that's all getting close to her like that. She bitched about tipping last week, but the tip she got from anyone was Nader years ago. Wah, wah. Yeah. Uh, that's it. That was the last tip she got. Yep. Yeah. What up, Drunksley? Why is there so much drama over our new car? Like what? There's no drama about it. You made a weird car review video and people laughed at it. Why are you so offended? Yeah, I don't know why you thought that you had to be so secretive and quiet about your last SUV. Right, we didn't get a car review for the last car that they got. And you get this new one and, and people... Like, oh, look at you can turn the volume up and down on the steering wheel. My car's so much better than every other car. Like... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Shelly, have you watched a Shrek movie recently? No, no. I, I think the $25 donation ruined that for her. <laughs> but I think a lot it. of people here haven't seen it, so someone should hit that up. Mm -hmm. It won't break the train either. Um, I've arbitrarily decided this is a rule. Okay. But yeah, no, you, you do this whole ad for this car that has just completely basic features. You lie about how much it cost. Mm -hmm. And then when people go, hey, this 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 isn't what it says here. And look, it's banned in Australia because it catches on fire. It, there's a fire extinguisher in the passenger seat because they catch on fire. And she Everybody's goes, well, that's just hate, making drama. drama. Hate, hate drama. You're just making drama. <laughs> Ammo says, hey, all. Sorry, I'm late. Deep fried turkey burns are flooding the ER this year. Ooh, wee. What's up? Besides Chantel's blood sugar levels. <laughs> mm, that's a good oh, question. That was good, Emma. Thank you, Emma. It's a very it's an expensive car. It's so, not. It's twenty thousand American new. Yeah, it's not expensive. I thought it was broke. You can get a fucking It doesn't matter why Chevy Volt for that. But for her to come out like this is an expensive and it's a, car. It's a Who cares four, how expensive your car is? It's a four-cylinder. It, 
It doesn't matter. It's got, how a, ex- like, you're, it's got a Cavalier engine. Even if it was expensive, like if it was a seventy thousand dollar car, and she made this video, it was she would still have made it for the same purpose to be flexing on everybody to show how much money she has and how much better she is with her mm-hmm. buttons on the dashboard than everybody else. Like it, it's your purpose for doing it, not the car itself. Mm-hmm. Just stop. I thought I'm not making the views I was. You don't need to brag about something that's not worth bragging Look, about. You can, I, I'll bet she makes about three grand monthly. American. And that's good money. American, yeah. But she spends it all on food. It's food, and the car is what? $200 mm-hmm. payments, not counting the trade in on the old car. Right. So maybe $150 a month. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that is completely affordable. Mm hmm. I thought, uh,. I'm super broke, so we have to buy bargain items. No, you go to food banks. There's a difference. Man, you bought a bargain car. It's literally a bargain car. Uh, Shelby, 25 flat. <laughs> Which... And it's a very special somebody, too. Again, scrutinizing the groceries I buy. <clears throat> like, am I supposed to buy Gucci brand milk? Like, I don't, I don't get it. These people... Another stab at FFG about the Gucci bag. Yeah, nobody said you need to buy fancy milk you live in a country where all the food is weird no one expected you to buy gucci milk ma'am this is a we very we expect you to not take food from starving people at the food bank that would be nice this is a very weird dig uh-huh. am i supposed to buy gucci milk right no very strange just don't go to food banks yeah people are so petty and bitter that's how you sound no, you sound bitter right now, honey. I mean, literally, what's bitter? Going, hey, this car isn't $30,000 and it's a fire hazard or bringing up the fact that somebody's ex died and right. left two kids. What's bitter? Right. What? Someone please tell me. Really, I mean... You have to pick apart every little thing someone does. You're bitter. Chantal. <laughs> this is what you do. Mm-hmm. And I'll tell you something. People might think I'm bitter because people make more views than me. They make more money. They make more super chats, whatever. Oh, That's here we go. Is. One more time for the people in the back. And I'll tell you something. People might think I'm bitter because... Right. And she's going to tell us why she's bitter. Uh-huh. People think I'm bitter, but here's why I'm bitter and angry. Yep. People make more views than me. They make more money. They make more super chats. Whatever. The Streamlabs should be the way all creators go, but... I don't even really go live anymore, so if I cared about super chats, you know? Hmm, you don't go face. live... <laughs> you don't face. go live because you make an ass out of yourself every time. Yep. I'm sure I could make way more views. I let down her hungry abaya right there. And we have a full foodie blackout. If I talked crap about these people every day, you could involve myself in the drama. You do. I mean, you. You do talk crap every day and is, involve yourself in the drama. This is what you do. But I'm never going to do that. You're literally Lazy. doing it right now. She could just make a reaction video. She could have FFG's little video playing here and just refute all the things she says and do her little back and forth and get her point across. But she's not going to do it Mm-mm. because it's editing and it's work and it's she didn't kind of bother. Exactly. She'll get a bunch of views. No, I did like a rea- we can't do the flamingo anymore. What? Copyright. Nuh-uh. Yeah. No. Yep. <sighs> Why would he do that to us? Uh, it's whatever company he signed with probably oh that's so sad neighbor shenanery indeed reaction video a parody uh, we can do it once in a while but we can't do it every stream once in a while but to make that my sole content just for money it wouldn't be just for money Chantel. it would be to get your side right because everything everybody says about you is a lie and all if you just could say your side then we would all know that it was all lies but you don't want your audience exposed to facts because anytime any of her little audience friends went over to try to argue with FFG, they ended up on her side yeah. because it, all of your lies are pointed out. So it's, she's I mean, never going to do a reaction with, like she should. No. 
No, God, no. Guys, we could do Flamingo once in a while. But Maybe if we like, do it at the end, that way it's easy to cut out. Can, is that we'll, cut outable? We'll see. I don't want to be hum. What disgusts me? And I'm more worried about my karma. And I'm more yeah. worried about my, she, a, a three paragraph post talking about somebody's ex and their past relationships and their children and their blah, 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 blah. You don't want to become the thing that you are because of karma? <laughs> what? <laughs> you you are existing <laughs> in your karma right now. Right. We literally just saw you. We reread the we saw the paragraphs that you wrote picking people apart for no reason. Th this is this is your karma. Mm -hmm. Like we're watching it. You are penniless essentially. Locked in a one windowed cell in Kuwait eating Peanut slop. butter slop Blech. for 15,000 views on YouTube. Yep. This is your karma. It is. And living a happy, mentally stable life. You know, like we do well. We do well. Well enough. And mashallah. Alhamdulillah. Mashallah. I'm so happy. I can't complain. Alhamdulillah. I need to learn some words. So... If I would rather have my life with a little less views. I She thinks she's spiting everybody by doing this. Mm -hmm. it, 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 everybody. Not just YouTube haters. Natter. Her parents. Yeah. Everybody. Then have to be somebody who's, an, who's a hypocrite. Also obese. Coward. Can knock him up. Um... Why, if she is so bothered, why does she even pay attention? Like if, if I was just doing my thing, living my life, I'm super happy, we're so blessed, we have, we have so much money and love and everything's perfect, I'm not going to spend my day watching one person who doesn't like me talk about me. I'm going to just ignore them. It's the internet. Yeah. It's not like if, if she's next door to you screaming through the wall and you can't not hear her. Just don't watch. About three minutes. <clears throat> just pop it in to say hi and tell everybody how good of a job Shelly is doing per usual. I'll see y'all in the highlights throughout the week. Thank you, Kimmy. Thank you, Kimmy. I love you. Appreciate him. that. We are about 25% to goal for our hate food money something. We need to feed Eve snacks with hate money. Yes, we need hate snacks. 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 <laughs> Coward. Can knock him up. Um. Look at... Look at... I love... Like, hold on. <laughs> this is her thinking. What more mean things can I say? No, hold on. I With got this. With spaghetti all over my chin. S smug. Uh huh. Smug, smug, smuggity, smug, smug. Right? Yeah. Smug, smug, smug. Funkle. Funkle. Funkle, smug. Smug. Funkle. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look at that, though. Seriously. I see. Yeah? Yeah. Uh. Two different people. Eh? Uh. <laughs> Has to make up a man. Dr. Funko Mrs. Cheek. Two different faces. The same person. Uh, sorry to say this, but has a face that only... Fa <laughs> Ma'am, don't talk about people's faces with your face looking like your face right now. What are you doing? We're looking at your face right now. Why are you talking about anyone's faces? <laughs> FFG's husband ugly as a dog <laughs> <laughs> not even real like the fake news that they spread about me <laughs> ugly as a dog you see my wife she's beautiful <laughs> um, has to make up a man he's not even real and mm. he's ugly as a dog <laughs> Uh, sorry to say this, but has a face that only... I'm sorry to say, ugly, no face. No, <laughs> it's not even a face. I looked at her, I said, where's the face? There's no face. A fake mm, man Chantel called. is hotter than 90% of you two. 99? Super hot. Has to screech every day, hating on someone. Oh, God, John, that's f 
fucking insane. Oh boy. Uh, who they apparently can't stand, but has to watch every little thing I do for content. Yeah, I would. I would rather take my life. Yeah. Why are you watching every little thing she does? Stop it. Enjoy your life. So again. It was literally a bingo on our thing. FFGs or FFG, a uh, foodie beauty's made up lover. Right. I don't care about views. I don't care about. She used to make up men constantly. Like I said before. I have a target of like 5,000 views per video. At 100,000-ish subs? Hmm. Not, not great. Even when my channel, like my old main channel was dead. Dead, dead. Stopped being pushed up by YouTube, any of that shit. I was still getting like 10,000 views. Of, you know? Yeah. She's, she's, she just wants five. Just enough to pay for her food and her car. That's good enough for Sounds her. Like car. Yes. A little side hustle for me. FFG said that foodie wants to wear her skin. It kind of Ugh. feels like that. I mean, she's in Canada. She's smaller. She's has a husband that likes her, probably. I bet she does. That's true, Sam. Half of those views were you. That's, yeah, that's okay. You know? Crosses myself. R.I.P. old channel. So, whatever. But don't sit there and, and say the most vile things about us every day. And then, when we... What's vile? No one's talking about how you and him don't bang. No one's getting gross. They're just talking about how disgusting your food is and how he has soft hands. Yeah, pretty much. Flat back. Don't go cry in a corner. Basically, none of what these people say are true. We're private about our intimate life. We're Muslim. You can't talk about that stuff here. But if you know me from my past. That was literally all you talked about before you moved there, so. Yeah. I would never be in a relationship where we don't have intimacy. It wouldn't happen. Did she just say YouTube was a side hustle? I just let it slide because whatever she's saying, I just assume 90% of it's bullshit. Yeah, it is. So, it, 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 there's no point in even really getting into it. So, get a life and worry about your own life. Salah's an amazing man and fulfills every need imaginable. People um, are you talking about sex right now, Muslim woman? I don't think you should be doing that. Oh, that's true. Weird. Well, he was poor Weird. Before. You met him, he was living in a bachelor. He was alone. What's he going to pay? Even oh, you said he was rich and he had cars and a freaking mansion or condo or something. Remember? Stop with the warm Muslim talk. That's why it says religion talk on there. Bachelor was like enough money. Or when she pulls out the the non-contextual humdalula or uh, mikshala, whatever. Because he lived in a, in a, in a, a salmia. Woman, woman, woman. Hold on. Imaginable. Allah's an amazing man and fulfills. <laughs> what man? What man? <laughs> What's the like to dislike on this disabled by owner? Cause coward. She turned off all her comments. Cause on the community post. Cause coward. And the first comment. Show us more of your cooking process. It's just nobody talking about what she's talking about. It's all talking about the food. Yep. She deleted all the other comments. So weird. We need. Sub 8,000 views on this, too. People will say, well, he was poor before you met him. He was living in a bachelor. He was alone. What's he going to pay? Chicken sushi. You should see the 25. We hit. We had two of them right at the beginning of the show. It is chef's kiss. Literally. It's, it's gross. It is literally chef's kiss. Even it's that gross. bachelor was like enough money because he lived in a, in a, in a, a salmia. <laughs> Dude, could you put more? F take that back out. I no, know. I hate when she takes it back out. I, ne I need you to take that back out, please. Uh, no. That spoon is massive, too. It's like a freaking tablespoon, serving spoon. Look thing. at the shovel tongue. Yeah. Only on one side. Yeah, look at how it sticks out to the side. That's weird. Why are you sticking your tongue out? Uh, uh, uh. Well, she's I, I don't think I've ever put a spoon in my mouth and stuck my tongue out. 
She's thinking about the the $25 donation. Oh my God, stop it. She's thinking about it. Stop it. She's thinking about it. It's like... She chewed that once. Oh. It's Chantel with her spoon. Why? It's <laughs> <laughs> so freaking gross. <laughs> I love it so much. A uh, call to curl for anyone who hasn't seen it yet. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> call. <laughs> What's the twenty-five donation again? Get hit it and let's see. Oh, I don't know. God. I forgot. <laughs> oh god. A popular city here. Whatever. He had his own place. He had a car. Uh, two chews to get that down. I had hunks of meat in it and everything. I want to see it again. She's gonna choke on her. Even that bachelor was like enough money because he lived in the in, 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 in Salmia. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's like. Gone. Four. Four done. A popular city here. Frank and Bean said that is a work of art. Oh my goodness. This is a work. Whatever, he had his own place, he had a car. I need an adult. I am an adult. Uh, did either of the two I sent you make it to the dono list? Uh, they were just other versions of that, if I remember correctly. And I just picked that one because it's Ricky and he was making the most obnoxious sounds. Uh, Yoshi sound, please. Okay. Let me launch a sound pad here real quick. Why are you always going over there? I need you over here. Well, I got to put the new pinky song on here, too. Talk to the chat for a second. Uh, Ricky died from pizza. Ricky didn't die. No. Uh, what's his face died? Uh, Devin something. Who? Uh... Crypt Daddy. Oh, did he? A while ago, yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, not. I like him. Oh, what the hell? Really? From pizza? Is that true? What? What are you doing? Hold on. Talk to the chat. That's it. The cup. <laughs> the. Couple where Shrek attacks the boyfriend is pretty good. If it's got Shrek in it, it's not going to be. Oh, good I know which bad. one you're talking about. That one was bad. No, it's going to be bad. It's got Shrek in it. It's bad. All right. Okay. We're good. I got it set. New pinky song loaded up. He lived to be funny. Okay. We'll pull it back. Whatever. He had his own place. He had a car. Thank you, Frank and Beans. He lived to be funny. And he's making it. He makes money after me. Like. What? No, he doesn't. What does he do? You know, like, it's so weird for these overweight women to just sit there and assume that he's using me for money as if, like, nobody can love me because I'm overweight. No, nobody said that's because you're an asshole. <laughs> you're just an asshole. And you're gross. You're, you're gross. You, you, you eat in a disgusting manner. You probably don't smell good. You fart a lot and burp a lot. You're not a very good homemaker. Or very wifely at all. So we're no. just saying what would salad say in you. You could be skinny and be all those same things and we would say the same thing. Yeah, exactly. And look, it we can the the eyes <laughs> me out so bad. It's like staring at me and the other one isn't. Mm. It's like you can we can kinda just tell salad's a bum. Right. Like he just has that bum energy. He does. All, all, the, all women have dated bums in the past. We can see it. That's just the thing. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> he's, he's got bum vibes. He does. When they're also obese, like, I just don't get it. And they're too cowardly to show anybody. So right there, it's like you should shut up because you don't have any right to talk when you're too coward to even show yourself. But the people that she's talking about, calling them obese and too coward to show themselves, like, they've all been seen before. We all know what these people look like. It's not like no one's ever seen what FFG looks like before. What are you even talking about? Yeah, John, that's true. But they haven't dated this bum. <laughs> Sam, I'm sorry. I'm sure someone will date you, bum ass. Livy said, not me. I married my first. Really? So weird. I don't have people like that here. Do, do, do you don't have... What? Th 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 that's just a Western world thing. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, Robert Riley married your first bum. <laughs> and Lippy, <laughs> yep. <laughs> you know, so for so long, like, how I've never seen people like this in my life that just like scrutinize the lives of others. Like, Come on, maybe she told me what he was getting into. He was a bum when you met him. She knew what it was getting into it. Right. Where are your kids when you talk about these vile things? They're not in the room. Don't worry. What, what the fuck does it matter? Where are your kids when you talk about these vile things? Where was your mom when you were doing your oh shit? Right. Like, what the fuck does it matter? Are they at home when you talk about our sex life? When you talk about... Uh... No one's talking about your sex life. No one is talking about your sex life. Does she think someone's going to look at this? Uh, let's say uh, uh, Livy. Let's use Livy as an example. Livy just comes into the stream. Mm -hmm. She goes, "What is this? Who's this woman? Why is she not chewing her food? Why does she stink?" And then she hears us talking about it, and she goes, "Well, there's a lot of context here." But she just said, "Where are the children?" So maybe I shouldn't watch this. Like, is that what she thinks that someone's gonna go? You know what? Yeah, that's right. We shouldn't watch this. They have kids, right? <laughs> What is the thought process here? It makes no sense. <laughs> it makes no sense. Just shaming in every way? Like, is that a good example for them, or what? I would love if my kids made fun of people like you. I don't care if they bully people that are like you. <laughs> Where is your Syrian bum fake husband, Lamau? Thank you for doing the Yoshi sounds. I'm dying laughing. <gasps> Just take my hate money to feed those hungry, needy children. I'm over here having too much fun. Thank you, Liz. Thank I'm you, glad Liz. you're having a good time. Why did she come in here with a wrench? <laughs> <laughs> the, the, the Yoshi sounds do kind of lighten the mood. Anyway, we don't let it affect our everyday life, but... That's very true, John Galt. Nobody has more opinions on parenting than childless women. Mm. It seems like they're all over the internet giving advice about parenting. Mm -hmm. It's really weird. Mm -hmm. While a community post or video will just be addressing, like, you know. No, it's not. Your community posts are not you addressing. They're you raging. They are her raging. Yeah, it. you can tell there's no chemistry. There's not. Like, you can just kind of tell. I mean, like, you can see she looks at him all lovingly and starry-eyed, and he doesn't really even look at her. I'm going to tell you guys two stories from our personal lives. Uh-oh. Oh, did you ever fix that issue with Twitch? No. Uh, read the chat for one second while I fix this before uh, I forget. Did you ever fix the issue with Twitch? That's what I'm doing right oh, now. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm doing that right it's now. It's not a plate. It's a serving platter. It does seem like it's a serving platter. It's huge and oval-shaped. Like, you would put a whole Thanksgiving turkey on that thing. Okay, it's uh, public now. I don't know why it goes right to private after the stream, but it's public now. I'm going to tell you two stories from our personal lives. One, we have a friend... They're a couple. And I'm talking to Shelly. I'm like, they ain't fucking. And she goes, what? No, they, they're they there. I'm like, they're not fucking. And then like two days later, the girl comes to Shelly. She goes, yeah, he hasn't fucked me in like six months. I'm like, I told you they weren't fucking. Yeah. And then there was another one. This girl, uh, woman, I should say, she divorced, very single, very thirsty. Yes. And we were hanging out at the bar and she's hitting it off with this guy. I'm like, they're not going to fuck. And Shelly goes, they're going to fuck. I go, they're not fucking. I'll bet you $2. So you still haven't paid me, by the no, way. I haven't paid you. Next morning, I messaged her. I'm like, did you guys fuck? She said, no. <laughs> I'm like, you owe me $2. <laughs> like, you can tell. You can just fucking tell when someone's not fucking. Yeah. I froze the water. I tried drinking the water through our tap filter. It was still a bit... Oh, Mr. Livy's out there? What up, man? Hi, Mr. Livy. So... It's Livy with two accounts. Water it is. Mr. Livy, we know she was lying when she called you a bum. Yeah. She was just talking <laughs> shit. But I use the filtered water for cooking. We all took up for you. Stuff like that. Hmm. But I use the filtered water for cooking. Stuff like that. <laughs>
I never K'd chick a bum. Oh, maybe somebody else called him a bum. Anyway. And I she think she agreed. confirmed it. Yeah, she agreed. That's what she said, yep. No. I said, you said somebody, women have all dated a bum. And Livy said, I married my first one. And someone said, You married your first bum. And she said, Yep. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so that's uh, all I wanted to say about that. <laughs> no, they knew each other, Frank and Beans. They, they knew each other, but they were just hitting it off. I mean, Amber Lynn and I have so many reaction channels talking about... The fuck does Amber have to do with anything? Because Amber's also fat, and everybody just doesn't like them because they're fat, not because they're assholes. I'm having a real hard time with Amber videos. I know you are. The dumbest things. Oh, would you look at that? She's hanging on to her fridge for dear life. I can't lean on my fridge. You, you were hanging on the fridge for dear life. We saw you. Yeah, I mean, we saw it. When I'm talking? Without it being a video for 30 minutes? Like, I... I... I, they do the same thing with Amber. Like, she used ground chili. She used ground turkey again in her chili. Why are you watching that? I mean, why is that entertainment? Who cares? It's so weird to me to just like always pick on the same two people for the same mundane, stupid things. It screams no life. You know, it screams no life. <laughs> watching all po of it. Posting yourself making ground turkey chili for the five hundredth time mm -hmm. on YouTube. Or eating a, a plate of slop and not chewing it for the millionth time on YouTube. That's also screams no life. That's true. Hungry fat chick weighs herself and nobody questions it. Huh. No one gives yeah. a shit. Yeah. She's out of breath for... <laughs> Eve, go see. Go see who made that noise, Eve. Steve, go see what that noise was. You're in church. That's gonna investigate. We heard a sound. Don't shoot the cat, babe. Don't shoot the kid either. Yep, yeah. yeah, but maybe for home for some reason. You never know. Okay, okay, guys. It's just us now. Mr. Sin's gone to investigate the sound. Because Eve is a terrible watchdog and she just looks when she hears a sound but doesn't go see. So fresh, so creamy, so screenshot. This is the best pause face we could possibly be left with. <laughs> I know Mr. Livy is no bum. He's a good bum, Livy, I know. Hide under Shrek. Why? I'm not hiding under Shrek. Yeah, you heard the click. It's probably the cat just skittering around. Amber is clickbaiting again about being in love. Oh, is she? See, I don't watch any of these girls until we watch them on the video, because I don't want to know what's happening. I know Mr. Sin listens to, like, FFG and things throughout the week, but I don't want to know what's going on. Sam, our Thanksgiving dinner plans are going to my mom's house. That was weird. What was it? Both cats were up here. Nugget was downstairs. Who made the noise on the stairs? Was Gray on the stairs? No, she was up here. Up here where? By the kid's door. Maybe that's where the noise came from? No, it was definitely down the steps. It sounded like it was on the landing. Yeah, she wasn't by there. Uh, it was a ghost. Thank you for investigating. <laughs> Frank and Beans, if you and your woman are in bed and you hear a sound, tell your woman, I told that woman to leave me alone. She will get up and investigate. <laughs> <laughs> Sam said check that for dots. It's very true. Uh, anyway. Same old, same old crap, as they say. Pete, you There's need so to be a better watch. There's so much things going on in, in the world. Yeah, Pete! Pete! <laughs> These people only put energy in. I said, you want ghosts? Because that's how you got ghosts. Maybe it's because I watched uh, Heredity again. You better not have but, like something else, you know? Okay, can you tell that was delicious? Every time I make this, I love it. Salah loves it. Just basically make a beef stew, but add uh, some tomato paste and some peanut butter. It doesn't have <laughs> If you think there's a ghost in the house, tell your wife it's girlfriend. Be a man. <laughs> it could be sugar, peanut butter with sugar. It could be natural peanut butter. I wouldn't use crunchy peanut butter, though. It has to be smooth. So, yeah. 
be good old Skippy, who knows? <laughs> Typically I use the natural peanut butter, but you can use whatever. All right. I like the natural peanut butter too. The my... oil one where you have to like oh, mix no, it that's up. Terrible. My favorite peanut butter is the peanut butter with honey. It's the best You're peanut butter. Hey guys, so good. I guess that's it. Thanks for listening to me and my thoughts. You know, that's all I have to say about that matter. Back to uh, oh, don't worry, line. you'll say it again. <laughs> yeah, we'll we'll get there again. Shelly, watch it, Shrek. It better not be. It's coming with Ricky. Better not be. All right, let's move on to the new ones. The <clears throat> we're gonna get into the more serious stuff. So guys, please smash that like, please share it out on your social media. As per usual, if you feel so inclined, slabs listed down below. We're 26% to goal of our hate money kid food or whatever it is. Yes. We need the hate kid money food. Or and we need dog treats bought with hate money. Hate hate treats. Hate treats. Mm -hmm. Creets? Heats. We need heats. Mm -hmm. And I bet you there's going to be some good Black Friday ammo sales. I'd like to hit some of that up. Man, I don't know what to get any of these kids for Christmas. I don't either. I don't know. They're, they're not telling me what they want. Yeah. The, they're, the they're... kid wants Jinko jeans, which are like 500 freaking dollars now. Why didn't I save <laughs> all of the Jinkos I had in the 90s? I could be rich. Yeah, she's like, I want Jinkos. And I'm like, no. And then <laughs> Sinatra Child. I'm Jinkos. I'm sorry, kid. Sinatra Child B chimes in. Without skipping a beat, she's like, I want Jinko jeans. And he goes, I want $100,000. <laughs> <laughs> Like, yeah, okay. <laughs> and she's going to get some knockoff wide leg jeans. Yeah. Just... No, I'll just write Jinko on them with a mar magic marker on the pocket. <laughs> Bingo. Done. <laughs> anyway, guys, smash the like button, share it out, do the thing with the thing and the slabs down below. It, the, the like ratio is shit. Like 700 to 250, terrible. Uh, the, then uh, the, the, the other thing with the pink salmon and all, you get the point. Tired. 1.25. I have diabetes. Oh boy. Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> the one thing I'm thinking about is like one of those little uh, game consoles with all the shit preloaded onto it. Yeah, the boys would like that. Hey there, beezers. What a perfect message. This is going to be like two. Holy filter, Batman. Wow, we look at that smooth skin. Uh, have you threatened to call? You haven't threatened to call the cops after all those Rickies. Not yet. That's impressive. No Dragon Ball. I'm sure we've had a movie reference. Almost new stream boss. Yes, politics. Yes, Eve. No club. Shelly anti squee. What? <laughs> You're cheating. Two videos. What? No but way. it's like the same day. Yeah, she's given up on buttoning this one up. It, it's just a flannel yep. shirt now. So, um, it's going to be a bit weird, I guess. Anyway, so this first video, I'm going to talk about a bit about my health uh, update. Um, I'm not going to do a weigh Not right really pasta milk. They're way into Roblox and Minecraft and that shit. No, probably do that tomorrow. But I'm going to take my blood sugar because I do have that monitor now. And I want to show you guys what my blood sugar is. Um, and I have been taking my blood sugar. It's kind of a problem. Well, it is a problem. A big enough problem. So. <laughs> oh, I got to hear that again. And I want to show you guys what my blood sugar is. Um, and I have been taking my blood sugar. It's kind of a problem. It's kind of a problem? Yeah. I got it for fun, but it's kind of a problem. We she she just got the blood sugar monitor because it was on sale. But yes. now she's been checking her blood sugar, and then she titles the video, I have diabetes. Did you go to the doctor, or are you just looking at the blood sugar test strip and giving yourself a diagnosis? Well, as we'll see in this video, it is bad. It is, uh, like, bad, bad. Okay. <laughs> well, it is a problem. I think normal range is... I have no idea, yeah. I'm well, gonna... I'm going to tell you. Normal range is under 100, and she's, like, mid-300s. Oh, my... I don't know what that means, but it's bad. A big enough problem. So, let me get to that first. But she got Timu blood test strips. They were on sale for $11. No. So, who knows if it, if any of this things even work. I mean, I, you think if normal is 100 and she's 300, she'd probably be dead. So. I have no idea. 
So I have my kit. Oh, 400 is diabetic cone. Okay. Put my lancet in. I won't show the the blood part, don't worry. Get one of my strips here. Now I did eat maybe like an hour and a half, maybe an hour. Normal is 70 to 120, okay. An hour and a half ago, so it's not gonna be like a fasting blood sugar. So she ate hour to hour and a half ago. But even my fasting blood sugar is like pretty high. So we're ready to go. I'm such a baby with the finger picking, I hate it. It startles me, just like getting your ears pierced. That, that can't be good. 316. Look how happy she is about it. Is she going to go to the doctor? Okay, so part of me has to wonder, is any of this a distraction from the rager? Maybe. You're bullying a sick woman on the internet. It, it very well might be. It's really high from what I gather. You're just I'm not making fun of me because I have diabetes used to the mgdl usually it's mmol the putting my... on the hijab didn't stop the hate yeah she thought it would because when she first put the hijab on it was well, you can't talk poorly about me because i'm a muslim and that's yeah. muslimophobic or whatever the shit is so when i was it's in gonna Canada, be i'm i'm diabetes phobic if you talk about me i know i had that machine um and they're gonna say like she comes in with this they're gonna go you gotta start taking some medicine Diet exercise. Yeah, and she's going to not do any of that. Yeah. She'll take whatever it is, but she won't diet, won't exercise, right. none of it. So she won't my change her eating habits at all. Sugars have rocketed in not that long. Not that long of a time. Uh, time period. Your, and your weight has also rocketed in not that long of a time period. Mm. Those two things might go together. You know, I Google says anything above 250 should be a trip to the ER. You know, it's, I'm not taking care of my health. I mean, it's not rocket science. I mean, you know, anyone with eyes can see that I'm not taking very good care of my health. Um, struggling with... Uh, nice job, Havasuma. Um, eating habits and lack of exercise um, and all that stuff. So, 316, when I fast and wake up, I take my blood sugar, it was 230 around that. So, um, which is still high. It should be like... Like, I think around 100, if I'm not mistaken. Why are you out of breath talking about this? It, it, for her to be like, well, I think it should be around 100, if I'm not mistaken. Wouldn't you be, like, going on Google to figure out, is this good? What should I be at? What like would, Wouldn't you be looking this up to be like, well, I think it might be around about, I, I don't know, maybe. Yeah. Like, why are you guessing at this? Wouldn't you be concerned and finding out? <laughs> so, I have a blood pressure cuff. Mm-hmm. My, I have high blood pressure. It's like 140 over 90, but my doctor thought that was too high. So I take it once a week, see where you're at. And so I got one of them things. And I, I do it, and I set my arm down, and it reads out. It's 170 over 100. I'm like, that's really fucking high. And I do it again. It's at like 180 over 110. I'm like, what the fuck? Then I read the instructions. I was doing it wrong. Oh, well. <laughs> my arm was bent. And I had the cup on backwards, so it was reading the other side, like the tricep instead of where the artery should be. Huh. And then when you put it on right, did it change? It was 139 over 80-something, oh. so normal. Weird. And I'm like, so this is shit you can do at home. Mm -hmm. And you can control it. You diet, exercise, you do all that shit. She's not going to do any of that. Mm -mm. So um, I went to see a doctor here about it. Um, you know, I told Salah my blood sugar is pretty high and um, and he said, I'll take you to a doctor tomorrow whenever I took my blood sugar for the first time. I was like, it was like 369 when I took it that night. Um, it was after a day of not eating very well. And so I told the doctor about my problem. Uh, but I felt like such an asshole because I was taking it wrong. Yeah. Because, you know, you're supposed to have your arms straight. I didn't even read the instructions. I didn't even try to. <laughs> and I, I, w I had it. My arm was bent like I'm sitting down. Um, my blood pressure is also high. So before I go on any medications, I just want to give it an... It also depends on the size of the arm. I've got pretty big arms, and I just, it's just whatever was there, so I don't know. 
honest try for now with diet and exercise, which um, they did say is the main thing that will help if I reduce some weight. Reduce weight, watch what I eat. Of course, they say limit carbs, which I understand now process like limiting um, the sugar because I have a problem regulating sugar now. So I need to really limit that in my body at least until I can get this under control. And then um, I'm going to go back. If you're a man, you're too busy to read directions. It would have right. saved me a lot of fucking heartache. A woman at 400 pounds or more, 5'1", sits doing nothing, eats vast amount of food on a regular basis, doesn't exercise at all, eats nothing but high-fat, sugar, sodium foods. She should not be surprised by those levels. I'm not. I, I don't know what know. she'd expect. Right. In a month's time, and if... Thank you, Liz. I appreciate it. My blood sugars are still out of whack. Oh, shit. I haven't been keeping up with any of this. I'm so sorry. One, two, three, three. Up to three. Boop, boop. There we go. I'll have to go on medication. So I'm really, really wanting to give it, uh, you know, try harder than I've ever tried in my life. I don't think I've ever really tried super hard because when it gets- Jeff, that's what I usually do. Ignore directions, make it up as you go, be a man. But I'm looking at the cuff and I'm like, why does this, <laughs> why does the thing on the back of my arm say artery? And then, a, uh, tell I, me. I like look over and it said this and down. I had it on upside, it was all bad. <laughs> it gets really hard, which it really is. I just give up, you know, I just give up. I panic, I, I listen to the urges, and I just don't, just don't, don't give it enough, enough of a try. And I'm getting up there in age, I'm 39, I could be living a very active, happier life. Yeah, Foodie, you're 40. Right. There's nothing stopping you from being active, doing stuff. You're not old. Like, no. You're not, you're not, you're 10, at least 10 to 15 years away from being, I'm too old to do something. Right. Healthier, you know, healthy, health is healthy. I am, I'm 30. I am in the best shape of my life. You are very good. I am stronger than I ever, maybe not <laughs> quite where I was when I did a cycle right after high school, but I am as strong as I've ever been. I am in the best shape of my life at 30. Nothing is stopping you. Dragon Ma says, 369, how is she not dead yet? She should know that it's not just sugars she should watch, but the carbs. Carbs are, that I have a huge. Right, because your body turns carbs into sugar, right? Yeah. Thank I you, Dragon Ma. Sure. Um, you can enjoy life if you're not healthy. I mean, my t trip to Thailand was awesome, but it could have been so much more awesome if I felt well. Um, I don't feel well. I feel like I have no energy. I feel like I'm 80 years old. Um, let's face it, I probably really physically have the, you know, the physical capabilities. Uh, some even 80 year olds even have more of physical. My mom was 81 when she broke her hip. When she was moving and grooving before she got sick and all that shit, circles around oh, yeah. Chantel. She was up, she was moving, she was playing with the kids, she was doing all that shit at 81. Mm-hmm. She had stupid feet and she broke her hip and then you know, all downhill from there. But yeah, Chantel, I would guess late eighties, maybe nineties with your physicality. Mm -hmm. I would see the shit in people when I worked at the nursing home that would get out of breath walking around. The cool capabilities. They also had oxygen taped to their face. They looked like junior soprano. And I'm not being hard on myself. I'm just actually being really realistic that that's how I feel. And it's a lot worse than it's ever been, feelings-wise. So I, um, I don't know what the heck I'm gonna do. I mean, I'm, I'm probably just gonna do this list here. <laughs> you know, um, that's just a screenshot. Screenshot of Google. Yeah. And you, you even said some, like when I lost all that weight past two years, lost a lot of weight, the most weight ever. Uh huh. My mood has improved dras vastly. I'm way more energetic. My libido is through the fucking roof. And I just am overall happier. Just do the thing, man. Yeah, but the, those first two, three on that list, are she doesn't have the care to do that. She's like, I know I'm, I'm unhealthy. I don't like the way I feel. But she's not going to get up and exercise regularly. She's not going to change eating the shit that she wants to eat. And losing weight to her would be like letting the haters win. She's yeah. not going to do that. How much weight did you lose? I was at my fattest. I was between 330 and 340. And I'm just kind of bouncing between 250 and 260 right now. You do the math on that one. But a lot. I bet your joints feel better. No, I think the damage there is pretty much done. <laughs> weight. 
Um, I need to be consistent with light exercise, even if it's just walking in the evening, because that will get cardiovascular. You should hear me when I wake up. It sounds like a fucking, it sounds like someone just popping bubble wrap. I put my shirt on, my elbow and my shoulders pop. I stand up, my knees pop. I stretch, my back cracks in like nine places. <laughs> system going metabolism going it's just healthy it's not going to be the number one culprit for weight loss right now i understand that because i need to start with my diet i need to cut out all the bad things all of the bad things and um it's just really bad how i eat so i haven't really been ordering out um really all that much compared to how i used to but i have been cooking a lot of things at home like if i don't order out i'm all day cooking things you know like, even if you order out you can order something healthy yeah. not a family size portion of rice and horse shit like you you don't it's not like there aren't healthy options to order out in sarcastic, I have a family history of uh, arthritis and rheumatoid, so I'm sure that's coming down the pipeline, too. Uh, so, did someone in the chat just said some libido through the roof. I'm happy for you, Shelly. Oh, she yeah. <laughs> I'm exhausted. <laughs> oh, that's what I was going to say. You can... You can get a salad from Wendy's. Right. She could order not, out and get healthy options. It's a, <laughs> Olivia the Kennedy, <laughs> the Kennedy situation. <laughs> but like you can get it. You can do it. It's not great, but it's still a fucking salad. I'm going to make a cobbler. I'm going to make cookies. I'm going to make a uh, put in, you know, I find ways to get to the bad food and uh, even if it takes more effort. So I need to start and I need to really, really, really put effort into it. And when the going gets tough, I just... Right, here, so she's, she's making this video saying she's really going to put effort into it. So in a video or two from now, when she is eating complete trash and people in her comments are telling her, you're not supposed to be eating this, she's going to get super offended and angry because everybody's just hating on it. Livy. <laughs> Libby, stop it. You just have to get through it. Lifestyle changes for the better are so difficult, you know. But with sugar readings this high, I don't even know what that is in MMOL, maybe 16 or something like that. That's, that's really up what it was when I was like 400 pounds. And the last time I weighed myself not long ago, I was three. I know he did, Libby. So I'm going to weigh myself tomorrow morning. <laughs> Hilarious. Um, film that. <laughs> Uh, I'm not doing this for any other reason than to... <laughs> How am I the one in trouble? Just be transparent Reminding me about that and just, moment um, of PTSD. Better, you know, and I want, <laughs> I want to have some kind of online support system. I want everyone who's struggling as well to come together and uh, try to do this, you know? And I say that, but I'm afraid that I'll let people down. But um, there's not really much more option for failure at this point. I mean, my health. Take her wrench. No. No. She keeps her wrench. Is not good. Uh, you know, she can she's never... a good girl and she's married to a bum. God. <laughs> she, and she can never look at a Kennedy the same way. Sleep again. apnea. I use a CPAP <laughs> machine. I have high blood pressure. I have diabetes. You leave my precious wrench alone. Yeah. Um, see? Like that. I. Okay. Wait, did she say she's 362? Like, that's what she weighs? Sarcastic Jay, did I miss that? Oh, we're talking about other shit. She financed that car for six years. Will she be around to see the title? Salad, well. She'll yeah. have to transfer it to his name, hopefully. Yeah. Or maybe name. it's in his name, probably. Yeah, it's more like. I just have to get through it. Lifestyle changes, for the better, are so difficult, you know. But with sugar readings this high... I don't even know what that is in MMOL, maybe 16 or something like that. That's that's really up she what it was. She says she's 350, 360. Well, no, wait, like, pull up that picture. I will, hold on. 100 pounds. And the last time I weighed myself not long ago, I was 350 or 360. Three, 360, uh -huh. okay. So this was her at 365 in Canada, and this is her probably 10 pounds ago in Kuwait. Uh -huh. So she's saying that she weighs less than this picture on the left by up to 15 pounds uh -huh. no. when she looks 15 pounds heavier than the picture on the right. Yes. 
she's she if if that's three sixty five, she's at least four fifty now. At least. I would say it's at at a minimum four thirty. At an absolute know. minimum. Maybe at an absolute minimum. If all the weight just went to her front. But I mean, but it's in her shoulders. It's, it's in, in her shoulders, it's in her, it's in her, her face, it's, it's her around. legs, arms. It's all around. Like her legs might have stayed the same, maybe. But like the round of the body. The body is round. And the head even is so much wider. So you would say the body is round? The body is round. There's no way that she is 20 pounds less. So we remember her getting on the scale and, and scale and telling us how much she weighed in Canada all the time. Uh, food for thought from Dell on Earth. Oh, <laughs> for, if this was a reply to Yabba. She's not an LB under 450. I'll stop that. So I'm going to weigh myself tomorrow morning. Um, feel Maybe bad. she's not doing the conversions properly on the scale. So she's... <laughs> You know, you got to remove 20 here for the taxes. <laughs> like maybe that's maybe on that scale, it says 350, but it's in some different way system. I don't know how way systems work and numbers and things. It's, it's pretty much just grams. So if the scale there was in some other weighing system and it's I don't think said they're doing stone, th whatever it is, if it said 350, what would that actually be in pounds? Maybe she's not. Maybe she thinks it's in pounds. Uh, I'm not doing this for any other reason than to just... Are we trying to price his writer? One pound, Bob. Be transparent with myself, mostly. Ever go to just... the, the thing at the amusement parks where they have to guess your weight or you win a stuffy? <laughs> and then they make you get on the giant scale? Um, get better, you know? And I want to have some kind of online support system. I want everyone who's struggling as well to come together and... Oh, she's trying to do a fucking... It's Overeaters Anonymous. Yeah, we all have to do it together, or I can't. Uh, and that's blaming the audience in the future. Uh, mm -hmm. Try to do this, you know? And I say that, but I'm afraid that I'll let people down. But um, there's not really much more option for failure at this point. I mean, my health is not good. You know, I have sleep apnea. I use a CPAP machine. I have high blood pressure. I have diabetes. Um... I, you know, I was in denial so long about that, like, because I thought I'm pre-diabetic, I'm pre-diabetic, I'm not going to become diabetic. I don't know why I was in such denial that I would ever get diabetes. Like, um. Why? Yeah. That seems like yeah. a very weird thing to just right. deny. That would never happen to me, even you though know? I have all of the signs of someone who has it, not me. Exactly. Well, I don't know. I really don't know how my brain works with that, but that's how it is. You know, I have depression, anxiety, I have all. How is it not bothering you how ultra filtered she is? Because I'm reading chat. All these things I just well, we noticed it at the beginning. Yeah, we it, did not notice it. It it looks like a pastel painting. Reverse yeah. and exercise. Can no. Can also help with depression and anxiety as well. So they say it takes 21 days, right, to build good habits if you're consistent. So that's what I just need to do. Whipped cream face. <laughs> Yay, 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 yay. I don't think I even counted calls. We're at 20. 20 awus on the train. Whoa. It's, this has been going on for two hours. We got 20 awus on the train. I think this is one of the longest trains we've had in a long time. It is. It's a good train. If nothing else, that's all I'm going to do. Um, it's just like a daily video diary of how I'm doing, uh, maybe like vlog style, what I'm going to eat. I don't even know. I don't even want to really eat because I look at my... my no. Now, 350 pounds, 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 pounds. My stomach, I look at right, the that's flesh. What, that's what I was saying. If it, if it was 350 kg, what would it be in pounds? Like I mean, it's just, it, yeah, so no, okay. That's my body, not, the, that's fat, the amount problem. of fat no, I have. She's just lying. I have a lot of energy storage that um, I could be using for fuel. I don't feel like I want to put more calories in my body. I mean, I have so many. Uh-oh, Sam's plot. Already, you know. <sighs> oh, anyway. Uh-oh. I want to give my body a chance to break down some of that and use it. <laughs> it's not happening though. Yeah. Anyway, if you guys have any like she wants to do it at all. Um cuz I know a lot of you have been through things and a lot of you have been successful. So share your ideas with me. I really need the help. Um and be, you know, as long as you're polite and constructive, I have no problem with you leaving feedback, you know? Never. 
Oh, let's see if the comments are deleted and only nice. Research the carnivore diet. <laughs> High blood sugar. Uh, definitely 400 comments, so a lot more than usual. Mm -hmm. A lot, lot more than usual. Usually she's up to 120 because she just deletes everything. Yeah. I appreciate it. <laughs> you know, it could have something to do with those 68 candy bars. Uh, maybe the entire thing of Pop Pops. The 70 pack of Pop Pops. Pop Pops. So that's my story right now. Um, I have another video I'm going to put out. It's uh, going to be a what I eaten in a day video. I've been video. I've been uh, journaling. Her her breathing is making me super anxious. <laughs> kind of like a food journal to see to show you guys and myself because I don't do this often. Eve is so fat. She just fell asleep in the hallway laying facing the room so she could get up quick if snacks appear. Mm -hmm. A full day of how I eat so I can really see visually Wait, you've never made of what I eaten in a day? <laughs> what I'm doing, you know, what I'm putting in my mouth, what's contributing to these these health issues, and I'm sure it's just overeating and overeating bad things. So but I want to see. So I'm going to do this whole day and then tomorrow we're going <laughs> to Is, is the diabetes in the room with us right now? She's going to do one day you know, get, of healthy eating. So we're going to do this the, day, and then we'll see what happens. Get going. <laughs> Kicking our butts into gear. So, um, yeah, stay tuned for that video. I'm going to show you. I think what everybody I, else needs to kick their butts into gear because of your diabetes, ma'am. Yeah, I've We're going to kick our butts into gear. We don't all have diabetes. My butt's been in gear. Uh, today. Be and, quiet! Uh, Shut up! Be quiet! I've been watching you and Miss Sin for about two and a half years, and you two are hilarious. Do you still have the bunnies, Miss Sin? No, I they do. got out of the house no, somehow. I, I do don't know how that happened. I do have the bunnies. Yeah, she does have They're them. the goodest little bun buns. I always forget that they're there. Because they're in their own little room, and I'm the only one who goes in there. Uh, thank you, Havasu Mom. I appreciate the, the kind words and the five buckaroos. Um, go from there. Anyway, guys, I thank you so much for listening. I know it's like, here we go again, and I don't blame people, but I guess time will tell, you know? I'm really going to really, really try because those blood sugar levels are really scary. My blood pressure is scary. I don't want to go on medication for life, and if I can avoid it. <laughs> <laughs> She's consulting Dr. Howard, Dr. Fine, Dr. Howard. You know, reversing these things with a healthy lifestyle or making them manageable, I will love that. So, yalla. See you guys. Yalla. Yeah, is this is is this a yala situation? Uh huh. Is this a yala situation? It's really? A mashallah or hamdalala situation? Yeah, it's a whatever the prayer for hope is. Yeah. All right, let's move to the next one. Let's check the bingos. Stream goal? Not quite. You have not threatened to call the cops. Nope. No Dragon Ball. No new stream boss yet, and no club. Correct. I think I have a, a cheap Dragon Ball. Is that though? Just one more time at that. So we are going to move on. Avi, my rabbits didn't escape. That was a lie. Oh shit! They're I in their own. You room. stink! Stink bit. Oh, we got another. Look, twenty-four hours, four videos. Yeah. You stink! Holy shit, man! Do you fucking mind? And also that we're arguing in the in the chat about soda or pop. The answer is soda. I try not to drink either. I have like one a week to uh, it's Sunday dinner. That's about it. But it's soda. You call it pop? I usually call it by the brand. Eh, soda. She's trying to get that November, December check. Fuck Maybe we're insane. in Ohio. It's still soda. Me too. I could, I could use a little influx. This fucking shit with my truck set me back a lot more than I was expecting last month. All right. Honest. <laughs> I love you start, start something with on it. <laughs> Maddie, I some bikes just called it cum. Oh, well, <laughs> that's a little different, I think. Honest full day of eating at almost 400 pounds. Honest. Almost. Honest. Honest. We're, Honest we're lying almost. about the weight right off the bat. <laughs> Honest, Honest lie. Almost 400 pounds. Honest lie. <laughs> How about we say almost 500 and then we wouldn't be having to worry about honesty. No, if I want a soda, I'll go, do you have a Sprite? Because that's usually my go-to. Do you have root beer? I kind of... Well, yeah, if you're ordering it, you have to be specific. Yeah, but, but in general, it's soda. What do you want to drink? I have Sprite. I have Coke. 
so, I, I don't know. I, 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 specificity matters. It's soda. That's disgusting, Chantel's raw dog life. That's, that's, that's awful. Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> hey there, beezers. What skip, 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 skip. So this is the what I eat in a day video as promised. This was right after the old one. Promised. Yeah, give me a Shasta. I'm going to show you from the first thing I eat to the last thing I eat. We're not fucking doing this. Nobody gives a shit if it's pop or if it's soda. Nobody cares. If I say pop, you know I mean soda. If you say pop, I know you mean soda. Well, that's true. Um, I noticed some habits of my... See, that it's the same thing. But if you order a chicken sandwich or a chicken burger, you're getting two separate things. A chicken burger is ground chicken. So that I, by watching a burger this video, is ground meat. I just See, don't that's an argument worth having. ...seem to care about portion size. Is or cereal soup... No. I'll tell you my take on this because ghastly fucking yeah, changed my mind on it. Okay. <clears throat> we were talking about it and someone in the chat asked, he goes, what ingredients are in soup? Like meat, carrots, celery. He goes, yeah, it's cereal is just cereal. Yeah. No not, ingredients. Not soup. Or how much of something I eat. Um, you know... You know, 1.83 corns on the cob with almost a whole stick of butter. So, I mean, I just... A whole stick of butter with... Three corn on the cobs? Yeesh. Like, a quarter of a stick of butter would be too much for three corn on the cobs. Yeah, that's a lot. Uh, it had to be Instead of measuring soaking. out... Like, it, it would just be in a puddle on your plate. It wouldn't even stick. Yeah, that's that's ridiculous. Unless she was, like... Dunking it in butter, maybe? No, I, w I would say putting hard chunks of butter on it. Maybe. And just eating the butter... Probably. I just don't ever care about those things. I don't take the time to be thoughtful or mindful about what I put in my mouth and the quantity of it. I just eat. I just I, eat. I like... Now, this is going to be old hat. The butter spray. Oh, yeah. I like that. I That's got perfect for corn. On the corn. Just eat. And um, it gives me a temporary escape from everything. You know, if I'm stressed out, if I'm working on something, if I'm stressed out dealing with something... I say, okay, I'm going to take a snack break, and I just eat something very powerful. I eat three sticks of butter, three corn on the cob and a stick of butter. Right. Just a little snacky poo. Or, you know, like a burger with cheese for a snack. Something not good for me. Don't do that. <laughs> right. Yeah, don't do that. What do you call a burger without the cheese? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Mr. Sin, I acknowledge... That it is and forever will be soda and not pop. I mean, technically, it's soda pop. Yeah. You say it short, just soda. Or some people choose the pop part, but it's soda pop is right. what it is. How about we beat in the middle, and from here on out, it's a soda pop. Soda pop. Okay. You know, maybe like two, three small bags of chips with like half a brick of cheese or something like that. I have horrible eating habits. I um, do have binge eating disorder. Uh, I have, I'm addicted to certain ham and beans out here with the life advice. Here's how you butter corn on the cob. Butter a piece of bread, roll the corn in the buttered bread. You're welcome. I saw that on a TikTok or something the other day and I thought how bizarre, but I guess it makes sense. Hmm. Foods, mostly take out junk food, all that. And I also am just not a mindful eater at all. So, um, my hunger cues are way skewed because of that. I just... My hormones are out of whack. You know, we have all have natural hormones that tell us when we're hungry, when to stop. I don't even listen to those. They're like, is it hormones that tells you that you're hungry? No, I don't it's think it is. signals from your stomach to your brain going, hey, I'm full, but it takes a minute to travel. Right. That's why she you're supposed to eat slow. Yeah, she doesn't eat slow. Yeah. So um, I think it's causing me it's causing me health issues at this point um, more than ever. And I have to do something There's about it. Horn sounds from their ground floor apartment now. It, but I think that was outside our house. No, it wasn't. It was in the headphones. So, um, I think it's causing me, it's causing me health issues at this point, um, more than ever. And uh, oh, okay. I have it's to her do something shenanigans. about it. Mm -hmm. But I wanted to do a diary full day of how I eat. On a, I was gonna say on a bad day. Hi, baby girl. Maddie Ike's on bikes. Day. You're talking a lot of shit for someone who can't even take stream boss. Say hi to the camera. 
She's crying. Oh, cat deflect. I'm sorry, but I just, I don't see That it. cat is freaking precious. I don't see Look it. at his face. Oh, Look at that face. That cat looks so Look mad. at that face. That cat hates Chantel. That's, that's okay. Salad's cat. So, What's your favorite N.A. beer? Nah, beer. Non-alcoholic. Nobody uh, drinks that. No. I was going to say what I... But my favorite beer beer... I'm an IPA hipster douchebag. I like those. So anything down that line is usually my go-to, at least for a couple. Eat on a bad day. The reality is every day is a bad day because I eat like this pretty much every day. The amount of full good days I've had in, in a long time are near zero. Um, I end up caving at night, being so hungry or just not being able to give into those, those, those urges. Right they're, to they're jail. Very... Right to jail. Right away. Right to jail. Right to jail. Uh, diabetic for over four years but gaslight people into thinking this is brand new information right to jail yeah right to jail yeah she's been talking about the diabetes for a long time oh yeah overwhelming and um <laughs> so that's basically you, how it's been for me for a true. long long that is true but you're still talking a lot of shit for somebody who's not sure about <laughs> 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 i love you but i'm calling it out time and my non-alcoholic beer you mean relapse juice body's relapse tired of it juice. i don't blame it oh, get some God. fucking o'doul's in this bitch i've been severely abusing myself with food a lot of times i you know just overeat way too many of the bad things and it just has to stop um yeah you know what i want to get completely useless absolute waste of money and will probably never use except sometimes one of those squirt guns that you stick in the top of a beer yeah you don't need that i know but i want it no what I just said, I don't need it, but I want it. Really, really has to. You know, the time, it, well, the time was like 10 years ago or 15. <laughs> I need to, uh, I need to, it's way past due. So um, I just want to show you guys how I eat on an everyday basis, the kind of things I eat, how my eating pattern is. Um, I haven't been eating out as much, so I've been making a lot of food, but. Uh, That's true, Maddie. I like somebody. Still overeating it. They have them on Amazon. What are they called? You don't need that. We're not spraying beer all over the house. Stop. It's outside use only. Yeah, no. It's just for me, it scares me, the thought of raw-dogging life. Like, I know that's... That's how you get ants. It's outside. That's where ants live. Well, you can think I'm getting close. What? You think you're going to get bit by a bug. What are you talking about? If you have beer all over you, you're going to get bit by a bug. You know, one of the... Raw-dogging life. Is, Is she really drawing a comparison between the high octane garbage that she eats to alcohol and drugs apparently I'm just raw dogging life with my <laughs> stick of butter Merbear's correct nerf gun bullets are easier to clean up yes i agree yeah but they don't... you can get a nerf gun can i put little shots in the nerf bullets no then no, i'm not interested we don't need to get alcohol all over the place it the sounds like I a mess to do, i don't do think we not need um, exacerbate this diabetes. I guess smoking can make it worse, and I smoke a lot of shisha. Sometimes I smoke menthols. You know, that's... But she talks a lot of shit about smokers, too, so take for what it's worth. It's also a comfort. That's an escape. And then there's food, which is my biggest escape. My biggest comfort. And I, yeah, that's true. She's talking about going through all this shit and everything she has to... All the problems and raw dog in life when she's supposedly the happiest she's ever been. Right, that's weird. And if I take those away, I feel like I'm raw dogging life. Going through life is going to be boring. It's going to be horrible. It's going. I thought you were happily married and always but busy. Going through life is going to be horrible if I can't stuff my face on family sized platters of food. Is that what she's saying? Y your life is going to be a lot better when you stop doing that. To be, you know, and I just, I know that eventually it will get better. I need to just try to get addicted to healthier habits. Um,. I need to get addicted to the feeling of feeling good. That's what it is. And seeing results. <laughs> Some fucking 12 step right. nonsense. Results and things like that. I have to be patient and consistent and a lot of qualities I don't possess right now. So I'm going to show you what I ate today. Um, you know what helps me with my problems? Heavy thing make vet sad voice go away. Oh yeah. Yeah. Lift heavy thing, sad voice go away. Hey. That's where I'm at with it. And that's it. Tomorrow is <coughs> hopefully going to be. Calm down, Mr. Peterson. Step one, eat your room. Be turning in a leaf. And uh, yeah, I'm going to try harder than I've ever, ever tried. I have to. I'm, I'm scared by what I'm seeing. I don't know. It's probably still not enough, you know, for me to to be ready to do this. Um, 
the thing is I'll never be ready. I'm waiting to be ready. I'll never be ready. I, ne I never ever want to go through the discomfort of having to change. I also don't want to be uncomfortable when I'm traveling. Uh, do you want to die? She acts like <laughs> she's going to have to literally starve herself to death. I'm going to be in so much pain and uncomfort and my life will be so awful and boring and sad. Like you can still eat, just calm down. Well, here's the Let thing. Let the food hit your stomach before you eat 20 more bites. Here's the thing. I don't want to go through life. Well, you're not going to have that much to go through if you That's don't true. fucking make a change. That's true. You're going to go through it peg legged and fucking not. You're going to be a pirate. Mm -hmm. Traveling when I'm just living. Arc me, Muslims. Life that I can't breathe. I want to be able to go for long walks with my husband. I want to be able to do a lot of things I can't do. So that's what I have to focus on is what I can't do. Um, st things I haven't been able to do for like a good 10 years or more of my life. Okay, so I have to stay focused on that. And I need you guys to remind me of that. And hey, that is hey. pity me, pity now me. She's, a pity. she's lying right now to her newbie audience that she has, pretending like she hasn't been able to go on walks for 10 years. I remember her ass jumping up and down, dancing, climbing on an exercise ball, twerking in her living room a year and a half ago. Yeah. Well, she was also Two on years ago? a lot of cocaine. But it's not like she couldn't move her body around. Oh, no, she had no problem. She was rolling down hills. Right. Going on walks, right. hitting the fucking outhouse. She was hitting doing all that pipe. shit. Yeah. She was Any doing all the things. Like it ain't been 10 years of her been unable to walk. Shut up. Yeah. This is just um, right now. Ordering crap, just all that kind of stuff. Um, so, yeah. Number one will be to stay away from sugar. I know because of that. And I, uh, I've just been in denial about it for so long, you know. And, all right, I'm paying the price for that. So, all right. So, here it is, my food diary of a whole day of eating, how I eat normally. All right, so here. So more of the leftovers the same from thing. yesterday. Yep. That, that looks like, oh no, those are. Here's something. meal number one, some leftover mac and cheese. Here is meal number one. Cheese, that's the last of it, had some yesterday. Bunch of chicken strips. Black olives, a chunk of halloum, halloumi cheese, some mayo and ketchup, and I'm gonna have that with uh, an orange drink. Oh yeah, sugar juice. Yeah, That's sugar what you juice. need. Yep. And some water, cold water, and that's gonna be my first meal. We don't need to hear the chomping. Mm. What is this weird That's angle? It. Try naked. I made this berry crop. Holy oh, we need shit. Less, we need less sugar. Let me make a giant dessert plate. Well, and has eat like mixed three quarters berries of it. And just like the crumble top. Oatmeal flour. Sugar, brown sugar. <laughs> and uh, oats. Did I already say that? Butter, <laughs> brown sugar, oats and flour. Yeah, that's Stevie, John. Yeah. All right, so next thing I'm- The fuck is this? Tuna. With, With what? Horse shit. I love this tuna, but what is, what is that, what's happening? This looks terrible. Eating is a can of tuna, mayonnaise, yellow mustard, salt pepper, and some fresh dill. Okay. So she made a so tuna just, salad, but didn't mix it up. And didn't put any celery in it. Yes, yeah, she put- Or jalapeno, if you're- No, jalapenos. Yes. Why are you pooping your pants? Jalapenos. Ugh. Lots of dill. I love it. With I see now, this is some shit I would eat. Not the fucking mustard, and not mayo. I would use Miracle Whip if anything. But I fucking love tuna. I absolutely love tuna. It takes two seconds to just stir it up, stir it, and throw some crunch in there. You will love it. Tuna. So that's the next thing I'm eating. That's the yucky with dark tuna, though. Yeah, you need the white albacore with two orange drinks and some more two. More sugar uh, juice. Uh, uh, it says water. vitamin C, so that means it's healthy. Bismillah. Okay. Oh, oh here we go. Here we go. Wait, didn't she just say I'm not going to eat a whole stick of butter with three pieces of corn? <laughs> that does look like half pieces, too. Oh, wow. Those are tiny pieces of corn. Yeah. Look, look at the size of butter. They're, they're like a, the size they're of a stick corns. of a butter. Yeah. Livy said why she heard the, that. No, you didn't. Why the whole so the next thing I'm butter? Gonna... You don't need the whole stick of butter. Leslie's right. Sugar with sugar with a little extra sugar. I'm going to eat 
is some corn on the cob, which is frozen. I boiled. I'm not going to eat the whole stick of butter, but <laughs> I'm going to use probably a good portion with some salt. You don't even need a good portion. Dragon Mama says she obviously has no idea about portion control. She's still eating for two or three people with those portions. She is. Yeah. She yeah, absolutely is. Can. See, there's her abaya. It's hung up. She's an achy. Yep. She's an achy girl. What? Uh, I'm just about to fold that laundry there. Here, so I won't show you that. You were just wearing that, you fucking liar. You could probably hear my washer spinning. Alhamdulillah, we have a washer and dryer. That's all I'm thankful for. And yeah, I'm going to eat this. It's my next thing I'm eating. And I'm probably going to watch a video from Creepy Comfort and Crime. You should check them out. Okay, so... Slop. Did More slop. This is... She just... She's eating all the same stuff as yesterday, but added dessert. Okay. Next thing I'm going to eat is... And I don't even believe this is all she ate. Probably not. Some leftover beef stew or mafe with some rice... And we still have some left over. This was probably it's, immediately after the corn. This, like, this is was all. This she's just eating one after another. Hold on, we can we can detective this. Shit. I'm probably gonna watch a video from Creepy Comfort and Crime. You should check them out. All right, we're in the same spot, but the laundry's moved, so it's not right after. Okay, so she probably is wearing it right now because she filmed the mukbang for this. Mm -hmm. So the next thing I'm gonna eat is some leftover. Yeah, see, there's her tray. Yep. Over. Beef stew or mafe with some rice. This is a lot of food for a day. Yeah. This is a little bit more. She's had two dinners. She had a full dinner for breakfast. Right. The, then a can of tuna. Then half of a plate of dessert. And then, then another dinner. Three ears of corn. Then the mukbang, mm -hmm. which exactly when this was made. Yeah. And then this, mm -hmm. she had three full meals so far. Mm -hmm. This, a plate of tuna, and three ears of corn with a stick of butter. Mm -hmm. And we're not done with the video yet. Ah, <sighs> boy. And we still have some left over. It's so much better the next day. And it's about... Um, 11. But you just said that the... No, this is the next day. No, she just said that the chicken strips and stuff were left over from the next last day. The, they're prob she probably filmed both of those on the same day. Could be. Yeah, I'm right now. All right. Oh, and oh, more and of now this. We need more of that. I'm going to have a bowl of my homemade... That is a full bowl, too. That's not just a tiny bit. That's a lot. Mixed berry cobbler. It's so delicious. And, uh, yeah. So sugary. That's what I'm going to have now. So fatty. And Yum. I guess I'll end the video here. Um, I don't think I'll be eating anything else. Maybe I don't think. Maybe just some um, sunflower seeds while we watch a movie. But that's all I'm going to have for today. And again, tomorrow I'm going to start fresh and try to make some healthy, low-carb, low-sugar meals to get my diabetes in check so we'll see you guys in the next one see you tomorrow bye does anybody believe that that's all she ate no anybody a little believe she had at least another bowl of that dessert a anybody at just a little believe any little believing of that because i don't believe that's everything no nope. i don't believe that's everything at all just come to give me kisses okay you're in charge for a second i have to go potty okay i'm in charge can i watch the video no Oh. Yeah, to just talk to Jeff. Remember how big her flat were is? It's probably mixing bowl. That's true. She was zoomed in real close on the plates and the bowls, so we couldn't tell how big they were. But they were probably the normal shit that she's eating with, so it was probably huge. A lot of bonos. No one believes her. I imagine that by the end of that day, she finished that whole plate of cobbler. Because it was like a third gone when she showed it for her first meal of it. Her serving of it. And then she ate another giant bowl of it. So Sala probably had a tiny little bowl and she ate all the rest of it that day. Raz Muzi said, I've only eaten two slices of pizza today and I'm full. That's me too. I had two slices of pizza today and that's all I ate. I could probably eat a breadstick though. That would be good. Get out of here. Why are you yelling at the dog? I had a slice of pizza, a six inch meatball sub, and 
lunch with the family. So oh, I, yeah, I had you did have lunch earlier. I had a half a sandwich earlier. It was good. <sighs> I'm just remembering I have a half a sandwich in the fridge. Microwave. No, right. I put it in the fridge earlier. Oh, okay. It's, uh... I bet it's fine. The bread might be a little soft. Eve, no. No Eve in studio. You eat too much of my stuff. Out. Go on, Dad, sit out. <laughs> Evie, out. Uh, we still have 650 people watching, guys. Smash that like. We're less than half on the like ratio. Smash that like. Share it out on your social media, should you feel so inclined. Stream up listed down below. We're 28% to go. We have 20 uh, woos on the train. And we are moving on to the next video. It foiled again. <laughs> we would got away with it too if it wasn't for that pesky something uh, dast no it was pesky it was a pesky dad trying to reverse type 2 diabetes the video <laughs> ah okay I guess this is just what we're doing yep we're day one trying to reverse type 2 diabetes she's gonna have it reversed in like a week mmm She's gonna be like, guys, I did it. I've been so healthy, so much walk, so My link hits, thank you. Yeah. Hello, Hello beezers. Skip, skip, skip. Special occasion gift. Skip. Bismillah, this is my dinner I made. What the fuck is this? Oh, I've been fasting for 14 hours. This is a weird plate. Um, I got a new plate. I got a Beatty's plate. Um, I did a weigh-in. Look at so the I'll real silverware, too. Okay, so I'm gonna weigh myself. And, uh, for the weird haters, lie about what it the says. scale is very basic. Max. Of 180 kilograms. Um. Which is how much? Under 450 pounds. There's nothing on it. So yeah, she can't use it. Where I can mess with. That button is for kg or pounds. The battery. And that's about it. So yellow. I have not eaten yet today. I am fasting about 14 hours now. So, um, yeah. Um, let's go. All right, time to turn it on. Zero. And she's wearing her full beekeeper costume, too. And probably holding on to something. 164. Times 2.2 .2 is what? Uh, three seventy ish. Does it say? Okay, one sixty four point five kg. Uh, that's a lie. I'll convert that. So yeah. So uh, either she was in Canada lying about how much she weighed by a hundred pounds. Yeah. No, or she's something, something doesn't. Something the math is not math in here. It's. it's it's, it's <laughs> she wouldn't have lied and said she was 100 pounds heavier. It's a crock of shit. That's, we, we see the two pictures. That is not 370. No. I don't care how you cut it. I was at 330, and I was still like half her size. Mm -hmm. uh, like I said, I've been fasting for about 14 hours, so that's fasted. Um, oh, I also took my blood sugar reading, so I'll insert that here. So this is my fasted blood sugar for... Wow. Today, well, if she's over... The, the max of that scale it is probably not reading correctly. Yeah, that's true. Time on the monitor is wrong. It's not 8.09 p.m. Um, I'm going to have to definitely change that somehow. I could fully believe that she's waking up at 8 o'clock at night. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, that's a fasted blood sugar reading and a fasted weigh-in. And this is my dinner. Chicken breast. It's a halloumi chicken. Holy shit. Look at what the filters are doing to the couch. In and this is my dinner. <laughs> chicken breast. It's a halloumi chicken. So it's um, some roasted eggplant. Just a it's eggplant. It's like the ocean. Making me nauseous. Um, about uh, a teaspoon of olive oil mixed between out each slice. And some seasoning. Very lightly salted. Um, it, it is insane how every clock she owns is wrong. Uh -huh. Chicken breast with some seasoning. Um... And I baked it in the oven with some tomato, black olive, and halloumi. Uh, and that's about a, about an ounce. Crumbled. Hey, Diana Fair. Long I time no see, friend. One kiwi. Hi. Some raw unsalted cashews and a loaf. I didn't listen to any of that. Blah, 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 and blah, blah. some seasoning, very lightly salted. Um, chicken breast with some seasoning. Um, 
and I baked it in the oven with some tomato, black olive, and... She didn't olive. take the fucking skin off the kiwi. Ew. Yeah, that's too much work. You want to eat those little pubes? Yeah. That's gross. Uh, and that's about, a, about an ounce crumbled up. I have one kiwi, some raw unsalted cashews, and a low-fat plain yogurt. And I have two waters, and that's what I'm going to eat. Um... Probably all this is a eat. much better portion. If you day. always ate like this, you might not have diabetes. Mm. Because I have to like lower everything very drastically, very quickly. Because oh, this, that's that's not gonna last. You can't do that that drastically that quick. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, you guys know if you watched my videos yesterday. Um, honestly, it's made me a little bit even scared to eat. If I'm being quite honest, it's weird. All right, let me try the chicken. I hope it's cooked through. It was frozen, frozen chicken breast. Oh, that's chicken. Looks yeah, with tomatoes and, and juicy. Top. Yeah, it's cooked. That's good. Gonna dip it in the. Oh, she thought about it. Yeah, she did. She hates it. She absolutely hates it. Mm hmm It's healthy. She doesn't like it at all. Mm. It could taste delicious, but it, she's mm. eating it for a diet, so she doesn't like it. She likes the yogurt. That's really good. No. And the yogurt. I She's like not happy. A bit longer. Not bad. She didn't like any of this. No. Nope. Let's look at the comments. Good job. Good bird. Intermittent fasting. Uh, I have some salted. You can see Jumbo, a doctor, smaller bites, chew your food. Yeah, that's, she needs to eat slower. It's the Homer simpson as fast as she can, putting everything in her mouth that makes her eat so much. Exactly. They're now so laws. <laughs> Can't eat those anymore. Her, that bite is huge. Eat a smaller bite. Her lack of being able to use basic silverware is it's weird. never not funny to me. It's weird. Hmm. Really good yogurt. It's the only overly processed thing here. Mm -hmm. Of course that's what she likes. Um, so, the purpose of this is not really- <laughs> Is she doing it like a barbarian? Really just mukbang, it's just also just to talk to you while I'm eating dinner. Why is such big bites, Chantel? I'll probably- uh, yeah, it, it took three bites to start doing that. I'll probably be eating a lot of stuff like this. Some kind of OMAD. I don't remember Pete's with a fork. I like the skin on the kiwi. <laughs> <gasps> she likes the skin on the kiwi. Uh, a year or That's two ago, my mom was diagnosed with type 2 diabetes. She got sick, had to go to the hospital. Scared the shit out of everyone in the family since she's lost 30 pounds, gotten it under control. I doubt Chantel can do the same. That's not going to happen. Yeah, either. no. She's not going to get it under control. Thank you but for good the job for your mom. Dollar do. We're at almost 29% to go. Mm. Skin on the kiwi it just sounds awful. She's just too lazy to peel it. It is. And we all know that's... Because they're a pain in the ass to peel. We all know that's the f that's what happened. Yeah. She, nobody likes that. No, I can't imagine anyone likes that. She's just too lazy to peel it. Look at her. She's looking at it like, I could just peel it. Nah, that's too much work. Uh-huh. She She's hates thinking, it. maybe I wasn't supposed to eat the skin. She hates it. She absolutely eats it. I can't imagine it tastes good. No it, calorie like left behind. stabbing all in your mouth, I think. No oh. calorie left behind. So I'm probably going to eat like um, very low carb, no processed carbs at all, no sugary drinks, just water, plain tea, maybe an Americano if I want to drink, but no sugar. Drink alcohol. 
until, you know, I want to get everything under control. These are really ripe. They're that really one was furry. all peel. Yeah. Mm. She's basically swallowing it whole anyways. It's so like I want to do intermittent it. fasting. I want to give my body time to, you know, deplete. I, I love just the toddler-esque fine motor skills with the utensils. Mm -hmm. And Leslie said she hates her breakfast. Kiwi's so yummy, OMG. Kiwi is really good. Yeah. I kiwi, kiwi strawberry's good. Kiwi's good. Some of the... Thank you, Leslie. I appreciate toys. that. <laughs> I used to hate on keto. You know yeah, what it is? See, she's eating such huge bites, and it's going to be gone in two seconds, and then she's going to be mad that she didn't get enough food. Uh, 223 said dot, 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 dot. You don't even have to skin it. Just take a spoon and scoop out the inside. <laughs> I would nev I, I've never eaten it like that. Just cut it in half and scoop out the inside. That's a good idea. Thank you, 223. And yeah, it's, it, it's not hard. I always cut the skin off with a knife and then slice it. It's the dirty keto, you know. I've never heard of the term dirty keto. But I understand the idea of eating low, low. Oh, she is mad. Mm -hmm. She's very mad. She hates this meal. Carb if you're, if you're diabetic, you know. Mm. If I say it's good, maybe I'll believe it's good. Mm-hmm. So I apologize if I just sounded really know-it-all before with that. <laughs> you always sound know-it-all, stupid. I can act like that sometimes. Very know-it-all about the diet that you literally are just doing right now for the first time ever. <laughs> I'm really starting. Life by Jen swore by dirty keto up until she died. Oof. Oof. Starting to love plain yogurt. It's keto, but you're still eating fast food. Okay, so she's just going to eat fast food. Uh -huh. It's not going to help much. Mm. So I'm thinking of meals, very simple, but nutritious. That's the that's the whole point, you know. Especially of like OMAD. Um, There's no way she can do OMAD. <clears throat> now here's a question for you guys: If you're eating chicken breast or a steak or you know something you got to cut up, do you cut it all up before you start eating, or no. do you eat cut, eat cut? Eat cut. Eat cut. It gets cold fast if you cut it all up. Hey, I'm asking the normal people. Like if, I, if I'm making it for you, I'm going to cut it all up. Or if I'm making it for the kid, I'll cut it all what up. What the fuck do you ever make? I always cut your things up. Because you're a big baby. So if I was going to make you something that needed cut, I would cut what it up you for make? you. What do you make? If I was going to make you something, I would cut it up for you. I would cut it up for the kids. But I would not cut it up because then it would get cold. What do you make? I'll make something and I'll cut it for you <laughs> like a baby. <laughs> Baba Yaga said, oh, man, going to make that home. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Baba. Uh, a lot of eat, cut, cut, eat, cut, eat, cut as I go. Really? Most people don't like cold food. I cut it all up, then you, eat it. You like cold food. You don't like your food hot. It makes sense. Huh. And if I really fork it, eat it like a caveman, be a man. You need to eat something again, something nutritious, high in protein. Low in sugar, maybe like a tuna or a piece of cheese, a drumstick, something like that. When I did OMAD, I'd eat like a whole chicken and vegetables and not just one chicken breast. Yeah. I think Sin's lost it. I don't know, man. I like I liked cutting it all up and eating it. Drink it, or just pick it up with your hands and eat it. Be a man. Yeah. <laughs> So I'm gonna try to do more. Hi. Yeah, but that's when you mop it up with the delicious whatever bread you have, Ugh. or fries. Whew. Stick juice. You're so cute. <laughs> when she wants my attention, she just like. Yeah. Okay, that's a good point. Do you use that same logic with like pancakes? Um. No, I think pancakes. I'd probably cut all up. I don't like pancakes, but I'd probably cut them all up. I was gonna eat them. Huh. I weird. Okay. On her back, it looks super cute. Maybe I'll maybe I'll try it next time. 
I do cut my burger in half, Livy. I do. It, it actually it depends. If, if I'm not super hungry, I'll cut it in half because I only plan on eating half of it. But if I'm starving, it, the, the whole thing's getting and going. Cute. Like, which pose can I do to get your attention? And they know it works. <laughs> so, yeah, things like maybe a hamburger patty, lean hamburger patty. Some cheese, grilled onion. <laughs> Bruce Campbell's chin. Who are you people? It sounds like aliens eating. <laughs> <laughs> it's so foreign to me. <laughs> Mustard. Big side of like broccoli, veggies. I always like to eat nuts, especially cashews. I Where, that's a good question. Where did the rug go? I find mm. that they're very filling. Mm. Halloum is so good. You're convincing us or yourself? Mm -mm -mm. Think Julia pissed all over the rug, maybe. Oh, maybe. Mm. So I'm hoping to be consistent with this method for a while. How long? Are we taking bets? Uh, a day. Say three days. Maybe. So long, I will probably go out. For a walk on the beach. If it stops pouring. She is so mad about this. Mm-hmm. It, but it's not just mad. She's like defeated yeah <laughs> oh you're so cute and quirky mm, it's why so is she right, sniffing it's very it fragrant. even now she's she's dieting because she feels like she's being forced to it's not because she wants to or because she cares or she any of the things she said in her last video about wanting to be healthier to walk with her husband but she doesn't mean any of that yeah, she, she doesn't, doesn't give a shit but no. she feels like she has to do it mm-hmm so she's not going to stick to it. Chicken's very juicy with the tomatoes cooked on top. Well, you said it wasn't cooked enough, so of course it's juicy. You guys it's probably have any... half raw. I should start a group somewhere so we can share recipes and things like that. Take that back out. I got to see the wrap no. around. No. No. I got to see the wrap yeah. around. Oh, we're not even doing the wrap around anymore. We just... Push it in that side. Mm -hmm. Sure, they can't feel it. We need to share recipes for my baked frozen chicken. Mm -hmm. I don't think we have seen Salad since the anniversary video. We heard his voice in the background on the last one. But then again, I don't even believe it's his voice half the time. Who else is it? Well, no, it's Salad's voice, but they I, they have edited his voice into shit before. Oh, so. that's true. Very juicy, <laughs> delicious chicken. I'm glad I made this. Halloum chicken. Halloumi chicken. I'll post the recipe for this. What's the mm. recipe? It's a chicken with tomatoes on top and you put it in the air fryer. What's the recipe? In the description box. The body is round. It's true. It is. Uh, Kelsey, I just got engaged. Glad uh... I can end the... Uh, glad I can end a great day with you guys. Congratulations, Kelsey. Let's Happy get some engagement. That's awesome. Confetti things in the chat. And I'll give you a confetti. There we go. Confetti. Yay. Congrats. We want invites. Yes. Or in the comment pin it. Maybe. She's 
so dejected. Mm -hmm. She wants to keep eating and her food's almost gone. And you know she's not full. No, because she's eating it too fast in two big bites. If she would just slow down. That's all it would take. Mm -hmm. Just slow down. Remember that old saying? Nothing tastes as good as skinny feels. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Scratch that. And say, nothing tastes as good as healthy feels. Uh -oh. Same thing. Same concept. <laughs> Same idea, yeah. Right. Burka blimp Bertha. Because just because you're skinny does not mean that you're healthy. Oh, here we go. No, just because you're skinny doesn't mean you're healthy. But being 400 pounds definitely means you're not healthy. Yes. <laughs> if she's raging at the end of a meal, you know it wasn't good. You mm -hmm. know she's still hungry. Yep. Mm. Do you not like those almonds? Cashews. Whatever the hell they are. She look how look at how mad she looks. She is not a happy girl. She is a very unhappy girl. Oh, yep, there it was. Yep. Ouch. Ouchy tooth. Those ouchy tooths are ouchy. Mm -hmm. She gonna say it's too hot? I was really mm, no. That earlier. was that was actual ouch. Yeah. I was like, never, never gonna get to eat pizza. She's already she, ruminating over what she can't have. She she's acts like the kid. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I'll just never have it ever again. He's starved to death. <laughs> I'll no, just you, never have fun again. You can't have snacks at eleven o'clock at night. Go the fuck to bed. Well, am I supposed to starve? Yeah. <laughs> I know you're thinking you shouldn't restrict yourself that much, but right no, now. No, but to. I have to so that I can fail. No, cutting out. Please stop. Cutting out shit. Like pizza, d d giant, tr giant trays of dessert, shit like that. That's okay to cut out. You have 400 pounds, cut that shit out. Like I can't even have things in moderation because it's not just about weight loss anymore. It's about health and I can't eat things that will spike my, spike my blood sugar because. Like giant trays of fruit tarts. Yeah. Like I'm literally on the verge of like literal health crisis so i really need to and no you're there death you are there like you are it's you're not on the verge you are in the throes of health crisis be right but if she just eats healthy for a couple days then it'll go away diligent even if it's something that depresses me even if it's something that almost kills me because in reality it won't it's actually good for me and i just have to keep telling myself that and um you know it's just something that has to happen there's no there's no way around it and it can be very depressing at first because when food is like oh here we go ew 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 uh -huh. ew 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 if you when you use food to to cope with things and you take that away you have to find what do you need to cope with you're the happiest you've ever been you're a lovely happy housewife uh -huh. all new ways to cope and I should really just be like turning to Allah and to prayer. So guess you, Jay, right? Salad will cave and order her so, food because oh she's going to be stomping so gonna... around the house like yep. a fucking raging maniac. Yeah, who's going to give her food? Uh huh. It's going to be here. Shut up. Mm -hmm. Try to do that, and um, just have faith in God, have faith in myself, have faith in His plan. And I want to thank you guys for all your supportive comments because, you know, they were mostly all really nice and positive and. On top of that, just a lot of them were constructive. Um, so yeah, I really appreciate that. It's encouraging, you know? What really also keeps me on track is... Look at this. Mm -hmm. She's not supposed to show that. No, but just... I see it. 
Huh? Looks like one of those 10 pound meat logs you can buy. Oh my buy. god. Thinking of the future. If I keep eating the way I was and not doing any exercise, I don't really have a future. I don't have a good future. Um, you don't have any future. Yeah, any. <clears throat> she can't get drunk or high people with diabetes, get intoxicated from high blood sugar levels. That's why she will never stop her eating habits no matter what. Maybe, Cougar oh, Knife. Maybe. Thank you for the dollar redo. If I lose weight and get healthy, regain my health, I have a whole new life I didn't get to live before. I can do things I've never done because of my weight. So we can go to all the all the carnivals. Um, you could two years ago. I still don't like some of the rides, You could do all kinds of things. You were rolling down hills, ma'am. I don't think she, I think she is in just complete denial that she gained so much weight in right. a year. Right. But like the reality of it is she has gained like 90 pounds in mm -hmm. the past year. And she just is not aware of that. No. Nope. She thinks it's always been this bad. No, it has not. It's been bad, but not this bad. Because I can. We can go to all booths. I don't have to have anxiety about going to restaurants. Um... All kinds of things, you know? So I'm just being really strict at first because of that. And I will always have to be strict and really mindful of these things. I realize that because slipping up is so easy. You know, all it will take is like one bologna sandwich, for instance, on white bread with chips. And that will, I know that will cause a spiral. So I have to. That's, you're, you're just already laying the excuses out. Yes. Really be abstinent in a lot of ways, unfortunately. That's not. You okay, just need so. moderation, ma'am. <laughs> so I'm going to keep trying this OMAD thing and see how that goes. If this was your OMAD, you're yeah, fucked. you're fucked. Um, <coughs> it's not going to be a huge meal, but it's going to be very nutritious, nutrition dense. Um, I think I should maybe also take a multivitamin or something as well. Yeah, everybody should be taking a multivitamin. A multivitamin. All right, guys. I think that's it. Bye. Uh, that's it. That's it. Okay. White bread equals dead. That's right, Mr. Green. She hated that meal. She did. Like, we could all see it, too. But we got one more. Our last one. Last one, guys. Smash a like, share it out, do all that fun stuff. The slabs at 30% to goal. 20 on the Awu train. Walking exercise at Owl Who Gives a Shit Beach in Kuwait. Yay. Oh, this should be fun. All right, any guesses on how this is going to go? Huffing and puffing and sitting a lot. Oh, what a cookie cutter intro this is. Mm -hmm. Hey there, Beezers. Oh, yeah, all this the video. couple stuff is on her Special channel now. Brush that cat. She brushes the cat every day and takes it to the groomer every three weeks. That's pretty matted. Yeah, that kitty needs a brush. Still precious, but she needs a brush. She's the cutest little Good night, and this is my- We had over a minute of cat content in the beginning. I, I, I like it. I'll take cat content the whole time. So I take my readings in the morning and night, and this is my nighttime reading. 3.30 a.m. Mm -hmm. The clock is wrong. I was told to monitor day and night. I will have my A1C checked soon. Nighttime in Kuwait. So she's- out at 3 in the morning? Yeah, she's going out at 3 a.m. Going for a late night walk? Outside with him. It's probably like everyone's asleep, we go out. Mm -hmm. It's winter here. It's it's winter? Salad has to back the car out of the parking spot so she can get in. Did you see that? I, yeah. <laughs> that's, that's bad. That's, that's bad. 239 <laughs> is bad. It has to back the car. Hi. <laughs> I did not play it back. I'm gonna let's play Christmas trees. It's winter here. It's not winter. But yeah, see, so you had to back the car out. But this, they have no problem driving around filming. Yeah, weird, but their excursion to the food truck an hour away, they couldn't film that. I think that didn't happen. I don't think it happened either. This is pretty bad video quality. I 
got the camera lens all smudged up with her so crease. So peaceful out here. 19 degrees Celsius. Beautiful palm trees. What's that in real yeah, temperature? What's, <laughs> what's that in human number? Let's see. 19 C to F. 65. Ah. So freezing to most people. Freezing, yeah. Waves crashing on the beach. Let's go for a walk. Notice how quiet Sal it is? Yeah, I've noticed. Alright guys, we're here at the beach together, getting ready for a walk. So, yeah, I'm just gonna go as far as I can, just, you know, nothing too I This, I think, is the perfect temperature. Yeah, you like first, it cold. Just getting in some fresh air, getting the blood going, so, yellow. Alright. Yeah, no. 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 Just no. Uh-uh. Nope. No. Uh-uh. No. <laughs> Very windy. Apologize about that. I just give us a side angle. It's empty. So I mean, winter season is front. Like dead on front angle to compare to that other picture. Yeah. Kuwait is very rainy. Goes down. Yeah, th th she's. J I I don't know how her back is not just in constant agony. Maybe that's why they got that heat water bottle thing to put on sore bones or whatever she said. You know, I'm not gonna shit talk because she is going out and she is walking, so that's, that's good. Great. But the waddle is amazing. I'm below twenty at night. But I love it. Perfect for me. I think so too, Susan. She's so gotta be five hundred. Good. Because she, she's not much smaller than Amber. She's a like three inches shorter. Yeah, not much. Too uh, out it's of breath yet. More than usual. It's like when you walk. Yeah, it's like watching a pregnant woman walk. <laughs> I like that these parks and beaches have bathroom public washrooms. Public washrooms here. We need to go sit down for 20 minutes. <laughs> they got a bench. I can hear the waves. And don't get me wrong. This is absolutely gorgeous. Mm-hmm. can hear the waves. Here. No. Uh -uh. No. Just no. Stop it. No. Uh, 65 degrees is cold in the winter when you're used to it being 120 in the summer. It's all about acclimation. I've been in the Middle East for summer and winter. You're putting on a jacket at 80. Probably. That's true. Yeah. And like here, 65, it gets hot here, but 65, I'm still wearing shorts. See, I'm chilly. I'm putting on my hoodie at 65. It, what was it? We had. But I'm always cold. We had 55 degree weather here the other day and I had my basketball shorts on. Yeah. That was when I got my winter coat out. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna do some deep breathing here. Well, the shadow don't lie, though. No. I love it. Yeah, no. Just no. Mm -mm. The answer is no. The answer is just no. What would you do if she fell? I love that Salad filmed that. Like, he could have not. He could have not filmed her flopping down the stairs, but he did. He <coughs> did. What, what would Salad <clears throat> have done if, he, if she fell? Laughed and then helped her up. He can't help her up. Pushed her a little bit. And <laughs> rolled, her. Rolled, her, rolled her to the car. <laughs> <laughs> Don't steal it, Chantel. <laughs> I thought she always brought her purse with cat food when she went to these places. Hi. The cat needs food, Chantel. <laughs> Hi. Poor thing. He's starving. Aww. Feed him. He doesn't want your pets. It's Feed okay. him. He's gonna bite her. It's okay. 
He's tail shaking. He's mad. Feed him. Here's your purse full of cat food. You don't have it, huh? She ate it. She almost fell again. Look at that. That catch her balance. So her weight shifted at the top. Wow. The waves. Wow. The waves. Yes. By the water, there's waves. Salad has not said a word. No, he's not. This is very interesting. This is Chantel's video. He's just the cameraman. Usually he's filming himself the whole time. She's moving though. <laughs> Cat thinks you're gonna feed it. In here. What? I don't have any food. So I know you got food. Next time we'll come, we'll bring some kibble. Hi. Aww. You know there are cats there. Why don't you bring Hi. kibble this time? Hi. Look at the waves. Didn't she just say that? Yes, she said it like four times now. Wow, so nice. This filler content. Yep. Check yo text. Just walking slow. <laughs> Taking my time. Oh my <laughs> nice, Louie. This is giving the first 20 minutes of found footage. <laughs> what was that fucking terrible movie you made us watch the other night? Oh, that was terrible. It was called Willow Creek. That was. It was supposed awful. to be a like. Blair Witch style hunting for Bigfoot movie and I waited till the end like hoping we were gonna see a Bigfoot chasing these people it was chasing them all through the forest and then it just showed a naked fat lady and no Bigfoot I was <laughs> so disappointed I was mad I, would, I wanted to at least see a, a hairy foot walk by or something no Bigfoot just a naked fat lady in the woods for some odd reason very strange movie I was very mad it was not good and I usually like all the movies <laughs> That will not leave us alone. <laughs> Do you guys go for walks after dinner? You're around your block. It, it, you're supposed to. It's supposed to help, like, regulate shit. How long do you go for? What did you start at? Engagement for me. Yes. All right, I'm going to walk on these little... This little walkway of <laughs> looks like railroad track, but <laughs> pretty cool. He sounds like two people are coming. We have to go dark area. Mm -hmm. We have to go dark area. No one see us. Have my water. Enjoying my time. She is having a hard time. Trying to build stamina. This shouldn't be that hard for her. Just what, a month ago they were walking all over Thailand? Yeah. This should not be that hard. It shouldn't be. But here we are. Southern Gothic, that sounds familiar. What's it about? So I did a tour. I'm just going to take a little small water break and just enjoy the weather here. I've just kind of assumed that every jump cut was her sitting down for a minute. I would imagine, yeah. Oh, hi. There's another cat. Hi. <laughs> hi. I love, I love all the cats here. <laughs> this looks like a tomcat. Are you a tomcat? I wonder if that's not salad filming. Gotta be. They don't know anybody else. Hey. Looks healthy. Stray yes. Fox, yes, I have seen that. That was good. <laughs> You're so cute. Yeah. Is he under my butt? Yep. <laughs> what are you doing here? I smell Where the barracuda. <laughs> Why did you say that? He's under my abaya. Hi. Oh, yes, I did see that Southern Gothic. I don't I don't think I watched all of it, though. Come. 
Oh. Can I keep walking? It took like a two minute, three minute break. <laughs> Why, Sin? <laughs> cat. Oh. A muskie. She's not going to go inside. I have a feeling she's not been inside once since she's been there. No. No. Salad filming the ground. This is very good content. Hello, guys. How are we doing? Oh, there he is. Oh, there. Hey, look how happy. He looks like he's aged like 10 years. Yep. Hi, guys. So I'm here on the beach with my supportive husband. Yeah, baby. I'm here rooting for you. Oh. <laughs> he. I am here even rooting for when you. When he talks to her, he sounds like he's reading his lines. I am root for you. Oh, thank you, babe. <laughs> the weather here after raining is gorgeous, guys. Yeah, perfect. I love it. <laughs> Very comfortable. Yeah. Well, this was nice. Um, I'm going to end the video here, guys. And uh, we're going to take you on different walks. So I'm going to try like different markets, different... Look at him. He's like, yes, okay, good. Fine. Uh, he hates it. Malls, stuff like that. And at the same time, show you Kuwait. So... Yeah, baby, I can encourage you. Don't worry. <laughs> no, I appreciate it. I will encourage. Don't worry. Yeah. Slap the food out of her hand, maybe. That <laughs> this is some fucking infomercial acting. I'm waiting for him to look at her and go... There must be better way. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, thanks for coming along. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Goodbye. Better way. <laughs> better way. He left this <laughs> plastic on He's her gonna seat. keep the pla he's got an off seat still, I think. <laughs> he left the plastic on her seat. Oh my god. Thank you. <sighs> yeah, it's like they all they open up the the cabinet door and all the Tupperware comes crashing down. <laughs> he goes, "There has to be a skinny wife." <laughs> oh, wrong line. <laughs> all right, that's it. We're done. Oh boy, guys, thank you for coming and hanging out. We are all caught up in Chantel Land. Guys, have a lovely, lovely evening. We will see you throughout the week for videos and all that fun stuff. I'll catch you all in the next one.